Go. All right. It's been a good three years since the events of Wheel of Time. The date is a frosty February. Or February? What? What is the equivalent of the February month? Give me a second. <sighs> Fantasy calendar. There you are. You. It is, to be exact. The month of emotions. Huh. It is the second of the month of emotion. It's been three years since the events of Wheel of Time. What has happened since then is, well, uh, the Torzokian uh, Administration of Health and Wellness uh, for Utility and Civil Services, also known as Telwex, uh, is now given a role in Central Command uh, in conjunction with that, the Torzokian Army. The head minister of its military forces, Klaus Desmond, rules with a firm fist over the Falowski territory and has become the new... Uh, he has retained his position as the Minister of the Interior and runs the entire Providence with relative ease. Thing, uh, tensions have cooled down, although there is always the same speculation that maybe what he did in that Civil War wasn't entirely moral. You think? What? No. I'm sure he was completely justified and there were no war crimes one bit. Oh, no, no war crimes at all. So there's not a they are, we don't do that kind of thing. And there's not a group of nine people that can at all just start start confirming those rumors and then get him arrested or anything. We don't yeah. do that here. We don't do that here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> Yet. Um, but for the most part, Tosaki has been a stable and fleeting country. Uh, its relationships with the larger nation of Lolas has improved, and borders have opened once again uh, for some restricted trade. Yay! Yay! Hey, hey Dragon Empire hasn't set, hasn't started burning it down yet. That's a plus. We arrive here at the uh, Merry Way Inn. It's a small inn uh, that is between Gohawk and Torz are not Gohawk. Yeah, Gohawk and Torzak. Uh, Torzak was the formal cap, uh, former capital of Torzokia before it was moved to Hawk. This is kind of in the center of the uh, nation, if you were to look on a map. I'm going to place your characters down, and you may have you may place yourselves anywhere you wish, and please describe what you intend to do. Well, I would think Nathan's with Anya at the end. Yeah. He is. Alright. They're probably sitting at the tap. Hey. The... While you guys place yourselves, I'm going to give a little bit more of a situation, if that's okay. Over the past three years, you were searching for uh, an individual um, that I think it was Zakaro asked politely if you could for him. Um, an individual known as Camilla Carlisle. She's currently being sought after by the entire city of Pfau, with a two hundred thousand dollar, uh, two hundred thousand gold bounty on her, uh, given to everyone um, who uh, participates, and that is per person. In the midst of that, um, you were told to meet here at the Merry Way Inn. Uh, well, Nathaniel was by none other than his brother Ethan Brown. <laughs> In order, and he said he has some key information about it at the form of a request. After two years of searching, he decided that this is the best lead to go by. And let's see where everyone's at. Oh, fuck. I forgot to put Fox Neil somewhere. Uh, <laughs> I guess Anya's cool. I guess. There you go. Outside. I am cool. You are cool. Three years, three years, and he's still, and he's still like, ugh. Ugh, Anya, mm, dragon smell. 
I don't smell that bad. You know that actually. She smells great. Thank you. you. Smell great. I think I think Nathan would have gotten over his dragon issues at this point. Oh, so. Yeah, it's been like three years. <laughs> More than that, if we're so. counting the time he got ki he nearly got killed by an actual dragon. Oh yeah. That was fun. <laughs> so I guess that going down fun. from top to bottom. Yeah, dear. What are you doing on this fine frosty morning? Drinking. <laughs> Drinking. Well, uh, the Merry Way Inn is known for its honey mead dew. Ooh. Ooh. Mm hmm. Honey dew mead, excuse me. It's like no. mead, but it tastes like honey. Good for bees. I thought it would taste like honeydew. And in this frosty morning, it's not the time for seriousness. It is the time for festivities. So let me skip that music. Also sitting as far away from the fire as possible. <laughs> Got a problem with fire there, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a shame, wouldn't it? Would be a shame, wouldn't it? <laughs> All right, uh, Ariane, what are you doing today? I'm just having a nice good morning meal. Having a nice good morning meal by yourself? <laughs> by myself. <laughs> <laughs> see, see. Uh, I think that's Anya. Who's in the upper right hand corner there? Uh, Jax. Jax, what are you doing? Oh, oh, me? Yes, you. <laughs> yep. Uh, Carl, what else do you do in a tavern? Converse? Oh, well, I mean... Drink? Drink, Think yeah, that, that, was, that was what I was thinking. Was relevant drinking. things? <laughs> uh, it, was, it was more thinking of the drinking part. Ah, uh, of course, of course. I am going to just shorten that to Graz, Graz, because mainly because that text is so small I can't actually. Grazverter, am I Hello. pronouncing that correctly? Yes. Graz hello, hello, Grazverter. What are you doing? Uh, I guess considering he's sitting next to Nathaniel, he's probably, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing, inspecting his weapons and grumbling about the condition of him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad Nathaniel knows Goblin now. Knows Goblin, because that's this makes that even more funny. And oh, how does a, that interaction go? It's a, it's a combination of curses and Goblin, Draconic, Dwarven, and Con. I know all those languages, so. Yeah. It's like, oh my goodness! At least I kept at least I kept one of the long swords. Yeah, but you lost the other one. <laughs> It's not my fault. It's not my fault. It's not my fault that I lost it when I got plunged into an icy river. It was a set. It's what? At the very least, at least I got a good replacement for it. I hold up the katana. Uh. Almost. Anya. Grazaverto is a very fairly older. I think late forties, maybe even early fifties. Yeah, is a, hmm. yeah, and like his normal hobgoblin hide, but ripped to hell. <laughs> as as Carl might put it, he's a chunk chunker. <laughs> he's a chunker. Hell yeah! And there isn't. He is covered in thick corded muscle from working a forge for a lifetime. It's fine. A lot of fight. As usual. 
Anya, what are you doing? Uh, what time is it? It's uh, eight in the morning. She's drinking, probably. Drinking and eating breakfast. Okay. Ah, uh, uh, hungry. I like to mention that I paid for her breakfast and and drink. Yeah. However many of them she gets. <laughs> Gotta get them meals in. Yes. Two. She's just day drinking a little bit today. Aren't you immune? Bit. Aren't you immune to being drunk? Would it matter if you day drink? It, I have standards. You're, da you're dating me. You have no standards. <laughs> Dang. Oh, wow. That's true. God damn. Fuck feels tastefully scribbling at a at a book while uh trying to have some bacon and eggs. Hold the eggs. How's the how's the book coming? Oh, uh, it's going great. Still very very happy that I can uh, you know move a little bit more than just between rooms. Therefore, I don't have to hear the sounds of a uh, voracious a wooing, voracious a wooing, voracious howling. And nope. that comes from both of you, <laughs> by the way. He's, he is he says pointing to both Nathaniel and Anya. Nathan just shrugs. What? Nathan just shrugs. He uh, does a little smile at that. The kind lady uh, at the at the end, uh, nice like half elf kind of person, uh, gr uh, happily just dishes out. Uh, she, she, she's known for a very fast service. Like, you ask for it, and it comes, like, within 60 seconds. It's just, like, absolutely crazy. Dang, girl. I'm going to give her 10 yeah, gold coins as a tip. crazy. Is oh, good nice. Stuff? How's the food? How's the food? It, it's pretty good food. I mean, good food. I don't know why it would be bad. You know, you got you got your bacon with your typical pepper and salt on it, and 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 so uh, and some eggs, and and sometimes it's like she does it any way you want them, over easy, scrambled, hard boiled, in a little like rose uh, shape. What? That's yeah. cute. Rose egg. Whoa. Any way you want it, that's the way you need it. Yes, Senfu, egg. So what's the other seems here? to have uh, joined. Yep. I want to sit between them two and say, so what's with the gathering here? More than half of you look like you only eat meat and drink protein. Funny. <laughs> it goes back. Wait a minute. That's not true. Yeah, that is. Uh, I said half. <laughs> Diet of a champion. <laughs> Who are you exactly? I'm the Eldir. Hmm. Interesting. I can't do the right voice for some reason right now. <laughs> if you wish to like describe yourself to uh, Nathaniel, uh, fuck, I don't have an appearance. You don't have an appearance? <laughs> I never thought of one. Well, oh. I guess for reference, you Nathan. Had two weeks. I guess for reference, Nathan's a six foot five black Lupin with shining with shiny blue eyes. He he probably looks more. He probably looks more like a bit of a. He's he's ditched he's ditched his good robes for like studded leather armor since he can't use mage armor anymore, and he has like two cloaks fitted onto him. Uh, fuck it, I'll use his old appearance, I guess. The Eldir has some, like, wide, flat scales along his arms, and then he has a girdle on his chest with a yellow scarf over it, and he's got some red pants on. Other than that, he has a pretty scarred-up body. And if you look at some of the smaller scales on his arm, there are areas where it lacks scales at all. Uh, do, you, do you make it obvious that you're a member of the... Swords of Justice? Bro, I don't know what they are. They're the giant... <laughs> they're, the, 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 they're, the, they're the monster hunting organization in Kessia. The Blood Hunters are part of them. Oh, sure. Yeah, yeah. so it's clear that this guy is a, a member of the proper Blood Hunter Order, the Swords of Justice. Oh, oh man. Sefnir! 
Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. A good one this time. Wait, what? the last one Wait. was pretty good. I'm not, I don't mean Seth Nero. I mean the other guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what was his name? Uh, the Lupin, the bad smelly one. Oh, yeah, him. Uh, have not. Ah, thank you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ah, oh, been a while since I've seen since I've seen one of you seen one of you, especially in Tozokia. Nope. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm being messaged by my parents. Uh oh. Don't worry, it's nothing super important. They just want to know what I want for my birthday, and the truth is, I can't think of anything. That's anyway. a mood, bruh. Ask for gift cards. <laughs> Yo, can I get Baldur's Gate 4? <laughs> 4. <laughs> if yeah, I the experimental version. Or send me gift cards. I'll decide myself. I also keep randomly cutting out from the call, so that's fun. Oof. No, that's okay, same. So, you, Wonder, have we met before? You seem a bit familiar. Just to make sure you're talking to me? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I don't believe we have. Hmm. Hmm. Might have been my hmm. might have been my mistake then. <sighs> he then he then um he then oh yeah he's he's gonna look at uh Graz Graziverter and he's gonna ask um quick quick also could you do me a f do you think you could do me a favor? Yeah. I need a new mask. Yeah. Give me an hour. Awesome. Give me an hour. <laughs> Just an hour. <laughs> yeah, I, I can craft anything in an hour. Mm. And then zoom in. Wonderful. He's <laughs> schmoovin'. Schmoovin'. What do you want it to look like? Uh, same as the original. Same as the original design, but less. Dreadwolf, I guess. Oh. Most dramatic. I forgot one thing about his physical appearance. Hmm? Oh, sorry. Uh, whereas most bronze dragonborn have, like, plated bellies, his is just smooth. <laughs> smooth skin. Smooth belly. Smooth baby boy. So, uh, I finish up my meal, but on my way out, I get interested and in, I, I see Fox Neil writing in his book and I become interested and go by and talk with him. Oh, yes. Hello there. Hello. Uh, how's, <laughs> how's the book going? I'm sorry, have we met before? No, I'm just uh, merely curious. Ah, well, yes. Well, if we haven't met before, I don't think you should know what's in the book. <laughs> Don't worry, he's always like that. What's in yeah. The a mysterious fella. You have no idea. <laughs> oh, nothing mysterious. It's just I like to keep things to myself. I understand. Can't go opening up to any stranger you find, after all. <laughs> <laughs> sure, he says. It's okay, uh, the innkeeper says. He's kind of a pushover, anyways. I, we've met for five minutes. <laughs> you're not that, yes, and I can already tell you a pushover. Oh my goodness. You're not that hard to read, <laughs> Fox. Uh, <laughs> great. Over to you, and in a very loud, his very loud, quiet voice. Who the fuck's that? Who's who? Fox, no. Oh, oh, that's my, that's, uh, remember that, remember that guy I told you about who I, who was kind of in my head for a little while? You had a Terzokian in your head? Well, he's not Terzokian, he's... Whoop! I'm a Tikkwil. Yeah, yeah, basically. Look, I had three people, I had two different, I had three different personalities in my head at some point, and that's what weirds you out? Does that mean we call you a bird brain? <laughs> who doesn't have a couple voices in well, I don't. Th well, when they well, when they take over your bodies at different moments, I think that's pretty different. Uh, well, granted, I felt like it was probably a good idea at the time. 
Yeah, I wouldn't. Yeah, you wouldn't have been able to. You wouldn't be able to have such fun adventures with us otherwise. It's true. I wouldn't be alive either. I think I have learned a lot in this short amount of time. <laughs> yes, if you if you stick around with, if you stick around with with me with me and her, he motions over to Anya. You get to you get into a lot of wacky adventures. But you still survive. Unless mostly. What I carry this group. We're we're, we're down two. Oh right. Uh. Dare I ask? Uh, um, one one was due to natural causes. The other one was due to choices. I would make an insight check, but I know I would fail. <laughs> <laughs> I, have natural, I have a natural insight of twenty. So, uh, hey, welcome. Hey, join the club there. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Oh my god! High level campaign. High level campaign. <laughs> that, that twenty, that twenty-eight, that twenty-eight passive perception, though. That's it. I'm pulling out a Cobalt Fight Club. Fuck this shit. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, hey, Cobalt. By the way, my perception's a twenty-five. Hey, your perception is a twenty-five, huh? Mine's a twenty-eight. So, hey, you, you'll have two of those to deal with, Car. Okay, players, uh, seven level, uh, fifteen. When is this thing's going to fucking generate for me? I'd fight it. Same. It just gives me eight cyclopses. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Ooh, cyclops. If you want, to, if you want to go to five five e tools and counter builder is a good one too. Has more options on top of that. There we go. Also, never mind. Also, I'll use that. Also, does Jax know Nathan in this regard or? Does Jax know Nathan? Mr. Jax? Well... I mean, he's a clan Lupin. So I think, by extension, he probably does. Because he's probably at that party. Hmm. <laughs> Anya screaming! Okay. <laughs> so Not the screaming! And I imagine he knows Seth near. So, yes. Alright. Uh, I get... Uh... I want to ask what plan you are, but I, I, that's probably more complicated than you're looking for. Yeah. Because I, I basically created that race. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let me phrase that. I created that race. Yep, and then lead to and then led to me definitely revamping the Lupin. Thanks for that, yeah. Tim. Yeah, no problem. Thanks, Tim. Thanks, Tim. <laughs> Don't they have, I should call you. you one, two, uh, three. Uh, down. <gasps> Wholesome. He looks cute. <sighs> I, wonder how long, I wonder how long it's going to take until Ethan gets here. I haven't seen him in... Shut up! I was going to put him in here. Wow, I haven't You're seen sure him. Enough. I have. I haven't seen him since I was a kid, actually. I haven't seen him since uh, now. Bum, 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 ah! Sorry. Does he actually walk in? <laughs> oh yeah, totally. Right on time. I kind of wonder. I kind. I kind of I kinda stand up when I see him, and I say, I say, in Lupin. Now I think I recognize that face anywhere, even if even if it isn't on a small Lupin child. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Come over here, man. Ah! And then I kind of like run over to him and then just hug him. I just hug him tight yeah. while picking him up. <laughs> oh, so... <laughs> oh, thank. <laughs> oh, no, oh my. Sweet. <laughs> what? I said no. It's that sweet. <sighs> I haven't, I haven't seen this face in so long. <sighs> Wondering how you I'm wondering how you found this face in the first place. I had <laughs> I heard some rumors that uh someone like you was uh going around in the little mountain areas around here, so I had to come over by. Take a look. <sighs> I feel like the walk through the, the mountain range is a bit too far, so I thought we'd meet halfway. 
That makes sense. I don't want to make that journey again. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, you'll have to later on. Yeah. Um, let, let, let's sit down and discuss what's going to go on here. Oh, sounds good. He says he sits next. Also, by the way, Ethan, this is Anya. Fox Neil. Hello, Anya. Hello, weird bird looping creature. <laughs> uh, Hello. And he, uh, he, he, he gives you a... Oh, yeah, he'll give you a hug. I didn't know you had such a lucky catch there, buddy. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, well, you know. Well, I know. <laughs> you know. No. I you know. wish. More like I wish. <laughs> oh, come on. You're telling I mean, me that, you're telling me that you haven't found somebody? You got the uh, you got the brown family charm, I thought. Kinda he looks he looks a bit sad about that. Uh no no no. <laughs> no, not really. Reading the room. Been, uh, what? I said reading the room, he's gonna be quiet with that. Uh, all right. Uh, who who are these people? Motions to the others. He points over to Gav Gravid's Verter. Oh, go ahead. Yeah. So I just. That was it. <laughs> I just looked it up and realized that hobgoblins are over six feet. Hey. <laughs> I have a know that. <laughs> welcome, welcome to the over six feet gang. Yeah, okay. The over six feet gang, dude. <laughs> Not my plan. Uh huh. <laughs> Human height. <laughs> or shorter. No, this a short hobgoblin is six three. Fuck. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. A short goblin is six three. Hobgoblin. A short hobgoblin. Yeah, they tall boys. So that's what that's what my guy is. He is a six foot three. I have the amazing oh. height of six foot one. Six foot five. <laughs> I'm six foot ten. What's what's considered tall for a clan lupin? Uh, short is around eight feet. Okay, <laughs> he's a tall clan lupin. So Just about eight, that. nine but, to ten. But still medium size. Oh my god! But still medium size somehow. But still medium size. Yeah. Yeah. Still medium. Pet people. Hmm. Pet people. So, but this is Gravitz Verter. He's an old friend. He's an old friend from back in the day. Oh, nice to meet you, Graza. Is it all right if I call you Graza? Uh, it's fine. Most people can't uh, can't be bothered to say my. I'm not the brightest in terms of uh, long names. <laughs> uh, that's Arian. Uh, no, no, I don't know his name actually. That's Yeldir. He's new <laughs> here. Know. Eldir, uh, nice to meet you. Eldir Kalimbeer. Ha ha ha. I take it you're from Miglia. Right on the money. <laughs> what brings you so far away from there? Circumstances more than anything. Circumstances? Hmm. I guess I best not prod into that type of thing. Then, I would prefer you didn't. And uh, the other two loop, but I take it they're more like of your order. Who's? Ah, uh, I don't know like any of the people here. <laughs> oh, sorry. He, he he was turning over to Nathaniel like that, and the other two loop, they're like of your order. No, that that order has been buried for about eleven years now. He narrows his eyes. I see. He, he kind of like he kind of like notices the no, and he's like, and he kind of like asks him, Lupin, what? Nothing. A little insight on that. I want. All right. Uh, what? that's a twenty-three. Twenty-three. E thought that something you were gonna say something different <laughs> oh he doesn't know he doesn't know mm -mm. he thought you were gonna say something different that's what you tell from the insight gotcha I got I kind of note that mm 
Gross of you yelled at your Kellen Beer Jacks. <laughs> Nathaniel will remember that. Nathaniel will remember that. <laughs> but, alright, huh, yes. Um, then who are they? I gotta look at them. I am Jax. Jax? Very simple name. Yep. My name is Arion. Arion? Uh, I take it you both come from Guildland? Something like that. <laughs> Alright. Can I I'm trust you? North. Can I trust them all? He kind of whispers over to uh, Nathaniel. Uh, how much... How much? What exactly are we speaking about right now? He plants some gold down on the table. And motions... Uh, or, yeah, the, the innkeeper goes over to him. He plants some gold down on the table uh, to kind of tell her, um, just take like a five minute smoke break real quick. Since she's the only one in the room, she nods and leaves. And no more funky music for you. This is so sad. Oh, excuse me. <sighs> Like it's huh. Well, I mean to talk about our my request, of course. All right. What is it? I didn't come here on free will. I'm on the hunt for something. For what? I found her, Nathaniel. I kind of look at him for a moment, and then I ask. Goldspire? Mm hmm. The Daughters of Unity, I think, is what she calls her little group. <sighs> Look. I knew it was, I knew it was coming, but I didn't think it'd be this soon. They're planning on staging something here. Something very sinister. It smell. <sighs> Looks like. They're camped out in a. Yeah, sorry? I was going to say, well, if they're planning something, considering what they like, I assume that it's going to be something harmful against Lupin. Oh, no doubt. They're in the dual grove. He kind of looks tired for a moment as he's thinking about it. Really? All right. Really? And so that you know, uh, the dual grove is a small forest. Um above Torzak. It's really unique in the f way wow. that half of the forest is one color, the other half another color. There's a trail that goes right through the middle of both colors. What colors are they? This is due to unique uh, magic occurrence, or perhaps two biomes next to each other. And the colors? Hmm? The colors? Red and blue. Alright. Like the picture, I said. Sorry. You're good. What exactly do you want to do once we find them? I think you and I both know the answer to that question. <sighs> I think it's a time, high time, that we do the Dread Wolves' good work, put an end to them once and for all. He then kind of, he then kind of, he then kind of sighs. Oh, oh, you don't know, do you? What do you mean? Seems Ethan, a bit confused. Ethan, the Dread Wolves have been dead for 11 years. I personally saw to that. You do know what they did, right? I know what they're doing is the right thing to do. Oh yeah, killing kids, is that what we is that what is that what we're supposed to do? He, he uh growls <laughs> they are they're a bit evil don't you think <sighs> look it's one thing to go after the actual slavers but to go after their families is another I, I i already i already got screwed over because of things like that we are that. going after them he then kind of he then kind of said he then kind of gl glares at him before standing up watch your tone I mean, I may be. I, I, we may you be watch 
yours. I may you be. You don't know how horrible these Did people have been to, to us. I remember. And you're just going to let that go? I'm not going to let it go. But I'm saying that we shouldn't stoop to their level. Fine. Fine. Uh, Whatever. Uh, Look, we go. Indiscriminate warfare never works. Thank you. But regardless, I am here to help no matter what. He, he, he takes note of that and he calms down a bit. All right. <sighs> the dual grove is uh, roughly uh, four days travel from here. He kind of he kind of looks at he kind of looks at Jax, Yeldir, and and Arion. Do you guys feel like helping on a hold? Uh, do you guys feel like helping in a task? Uh, I got nothing better to do. Another adventure sounds fun to me. Well, I can take a detour. Also, I figured out why I can't do his voice. My throat actually isn't dry enough. Oof. Bruh. And you, Jack? I'm having the opposite problem. If it involves us. Well, people we're going after aren't exactly big fans of Lupin, speaking from experience. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so well, I believe all Lupin are from the same great clan. <laughs> Good to hear it. It's so, true. wherever. If one Lupin's harmed, we all are. You'll have uh, roughly the same brain. I mean, <clears throat> yes. So, yep. Right. On so. Your, on your, are you in for this? You might see some things that are less than savory. Like what? I've seen it all. <laughs> Not with these guys. What? Do they eat people? Because I don't think I've met cannibals before. Oh, no, no. We're not doing any eating. <laughs> no, not what? that. They've just done some really messed up things. All right. Well, you know I'm in it. Come on now. Why'd you have to ask? <laughs> just checking. Hi. And you, Fox? Like I said, yes. It's very simple. All right. Kind of, I kind of look at uh, Graza. Gotta eat a Popeye's biscuit. Sorry. <laughs> I, got, I look at Graza. I'm going to need that mask sooner than I thought. Uh, give me an hour. All right. <laughs> for, reference, I'd like to, for reference, I'd like to say that Nath... Then Nathan with his mask looks like... Where is... Ah, there you are. Copy image. This is basically what Nathan's mask looks like. Oh, easy. Coolio. And, uh... uh to everyone, I... I uh, Ethan will speak up. I am sorry for the outburst. I knew there was going to be some things we may not have agreed on. I'll try to refrain from it from the future. We must maintain professionalism after all. I will see you all uh, outside. There will be supplies. Um, good enough for the whole trip for you. He will out. Hmm. I do. I do wish it was a craft wall game, but I can just use one. Of my uh, I can I can warm up my channel to divinity for a forge player because I can create any non special item basically that is under a hundred gold. Jack, never. See. I would think my mask is under a hundred gold, right, Car? Uh, yeah, sure. You make one for I mean, Anya too. I can make two today. All right. Oh, no, let me phrase that. I can make two. I'll need a rest of after that, and I can make some more. It's uh, two uses per short rest. True. Well, it's going to take us, like, four days to get to the other place, so you could make one for everyone, theoretically. 
Yeah, that'll work. You. I, I got my own mask. <laughs> uh, his mask being a scowling visage of his god. <laughs> that sounds uh, right. Nice. Uh oh. Logan, uh, excuse me. Brits cannot join VC. Yeah, uh, having a hard fucking time, but I managed three. to get back in. <laughs> Good. I don't know why my internet is crappy right now. It isn't normally. Mm. You've got a among us. I don't want to. Sorry. Just whenever I rejoined, I didn't say anything because <laughs> people were talking. Mm. Of course. Wait, uh, Carl, we need to update the achievements, by the way. But why? Because of the 20s. Hey, you still got the achievement. No, we need to update it now, Kerr. Now. I'm going to eat Zenvu. I'm going to eat you like a fucking chocolate bar. Well, that should have real quickly. All I right. Suppose, I suppose <laughs> so we head out then. Yeah, uh, Ethan is head out, leaving you all in the tavern empty <sighs> to deliberate on some things. So he's so Nathan's specifically going to speak to Anya and Foxnet when he says this. But um, so remember how I brought up? Remember how I brought up the fact that I was a slave back when we first met? Uh huh. Yeah. The woman we're going after in her group was the woman who owned me, or her family owned me. Oh. I've done some brushing up on the daughters of Unity. They only go after the Treadwolf specifically. They were told that their. What is it? Their morals were questionable or something like that? Mm hmm. There's only three Dreadwolves left, officially. Of the original, so, of the whatever original group. sinister thing is going on here, I don't know if that would be within their conduct. <sighs> wouldn't, surpri wouldn't surprise me, wouldn't surprise me if, um, wouldn't surprise me if, um, they were drawing, if they were trying to draw me out, since, since apparently if Ethan knows I'm here, they might know I'm here too. It's true. Best be careful. <sighs> but yeah, um, Goldspire did. Yeah, Goldspire. The reason why Ethan got so heated, especially with the Dread Wolves, is because Goldspire did some things. Like bad things? Yeah, to be exact. My mom, my dad, after my dad disappeared, my mom doted on me and the rest of my siblings a lot, but on me the most. And she made sure that I was always out of the house at specific moments. So what you're saying is, we should kill it. <sighs> the old me would have said yes. Would have agreed wholeheartedly. But... Oh, gone older, and at this point, I'm not seeing much of a point in killing her, especially since, especially since I did one, since since I did one up her by killing every single last one of her kids. Uh, I have learned a lot uh, more in this short time. Mm. <laughs> yes. For reference, I used to leave a sl I used to lead a slave rebellion about, well, I guess up to until about eleven years ago. We were called the Dread Wolves. It's dumb na dumb name, but but we st I st well particularly I started it because I found out I had a son and needed to get him back, and then I grabbed a bunch of lupin along the way, and this guy over here, and this guy over, and this crazy hobgoblin over here. He motions over to Gaza, and the rest became history. Oh. Gaza's just looking into the uh, what of hard alcohol he's drinking. <laughs> this is some deep shit I've got here. <laughs> <laughs> I expect he never approved of it, but he built the stuff for you anyways. Yeah. I feel like he always tried to convince Nathan not to like kill kids but but like Nathan wasn't hearing it. 
He's 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 lawful neutral, but he's not a healer. Yeah, he's not a healer. So I just realized that I was uh, misreading that nine in Anya's health bar. What were you reading it as? I thought it was a uh, two. Two ninety four. Yeah. I never, like look directly at it. Welcome to Barbarian. Uh, yeah, this is me. <laughs> this is just built different. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Um. Ever and when everybody's built different. <laughs> <laughs> no, I will be. Yeah. From nine from nine eighty three to nine eighty eight, I led that we led that slave rebellion. It was pretty turned out pretty well. Got Guildline to stop to stop doing slavery. Made Lalas an entire empire of dragons stop doing slavery. Then it went wrong. How so? Uh, I had a. There were four of us that were leaders. Me, Bla we went by different titles: the Black Sniper, the Black Swordsman, the Black Wizard, and the Black Mystic. Um, one of them, the Black M Mystic, a Lupin named Corsair, he was different, Lupin-wise. He, when we found him, he had enslaved the loop, the, fa the slaving family that owned him into being his m into being his slaves, and he did unseemly things to that family. And after we killed them, he was pissed, but decided to join us. We, but he only joined us so that way he could kill me and take over. And in 988, he did exactly that. Succeeded. Then I came back. And then I be and then I killed him. And after that, I, after that, I disbanded the Dread Wolves. So there's a lot Jeez. of yeah. So there's a lot of history there, and hopefully, and it seems like Ethan's got himself wrapped up in that cause, and seems to think that it's a good thing, quote unquote. Hmm. Well, if it's so, any compliment to you, I think you're one of the most interesting people I've met. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> but at the end of the day, I have to. At the end of the day, he's. But at the end of the day, that 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 whole revolt was because of vengeance, and I gave up on that, and he needs to give up on that too. So, if 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 you need any more incentment, I can pay. Wait, wait. Oh, I'll tell you this. You don't need to pay me. He looks at Ariana. As far as I'm concerned, as long as it's good, I don't care. Gotcha. I'm simply in search of leads towards my own goals. There's no need. He looks over at Jax. I feel like Jax just wax. Jax just wax. <laughs> the booty <laughs> brew. <laughs> Jack just wax. <laughs> He's a yeah, I guess they'll like put the sword up me. on the table. It's like you know, you know, like when a sword is just so well sharpened that it's basically just mirror finish. That's when that the entire blade of that sword is. Mm -hmm. he, he, I just whack. <laughs> well then, let's go meet up with my brother. Well, after we get those masks, anyway, or after I, anyway. <sighs> God damn it! Um, hey, what are you doing? Can I talk out of character for a second? It's uh, just something I think yeah. is kind of funny. Mm -hmm. Yeldir has this mm -hmm. code, sort of, where he'll try and protect anybody that's shorter than him, but I think he's actually one of the shortest people in this party. <laughs> I think he is. Uh, yeah, you're. You want to pick one? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, all three Lupin are taller than you. I didn't plan it that way. All three Lupin are taller than me. I think the Hobgoblin here is taller than me. So there's only two people shorter than me. Yeah. And I don't even know what Anya's height is. Yeah, I'm 4'9". Oh, very short. She likes climbing. And this one. How the hell tall are Tickerels? Because I know some were pretty tall, but is, is Foxy mm -hmm. tall? Foxy? Oh, okay. He's what? what? Foot six? I think he said six. Six. Six foot six. 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, there's one person shorter than me. Well, <laughs> watch out when Nathaniel doesn't think you're coming on Zanya. Try me. <laughs> Try me and see where that ends up. <laughs> Short people rise up. <laughs> oh man, that would be a great time to reveal the okay. <laughs> Alright. That's my question. What? what? DM, car. Oh, fuck me. Oh, I thought you were talking about Jax. I was like, Jax go whack. <laughs> Jax, go whack. <laughs> Jax wax. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's one I know of. You're not going to like it. I can see if I can find more. I actually have that theme going on somewhere. Oh, okay. Um, shit. Let me think then. Uh, I like. I want a very odd piece of music. How odd we talking? Hmm. Like it gives a very uneasy feel. But I think honestly, I might just because Lady Butterfly also gives an uneasy feel. I might move that there. Hmm. Yeah. But I say I could see if I could. F I doubt I could find anything in Fire Emblem in specific, specific, particular. Yeah. I'm I'm sure I'll think of something. All right. I take it we're all going to go out. Yeah. Yep. All right. All right. Move Let's go. Accordingly. And as you go out, you see. Uh, Ethan resting himself, uh, you know, he's taking a smoke break too, resting himself against a small, um, caravan. Caravan? Carriage. Yeah, carriage. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's a non-capped carriage, and it's driven by two horses. It's enough to seat four people. Hmm. Sorry, this is all I have. If you guys don't have your own transportation, it's fine. It's about five days for walking. Uh, what how fast you? would the carriage be going? Question mark. Uh, first, what would a tool's carriage be? A, ca a, a car, basic, no matter what, if you're moving by days, a car moves at the same travel speed as people do. Okay, then yeah. Oh, well. So about 24 miles a day. At I can walk alongside it. The elder has higher than normal speed. Then I walk back home. Kind of looking on you. You want to ride in the cart or? Yes, in the cart. Let's go. <laughs> yes, I too prefer not to be walking. As well as I suppose I'll be in the driver's seat with with him. He says, kind of like patting Ethan on the shoulder. Of course. All right. Uh, there'd still be two more seats, by the way. Oh, uh, sorry. Ooh. I can walk if needed, but prefer not to. All right. I was there is a spot. You don't look like the hardiest of this bunch. <laughs> no. He doesn't look like the hardiest of the bunch. Excuse me. <laughs> I mean, when compared to Anya, well, that says a to, lot. No, talking to Arion, he doesn't. Look <laughs> like I look pretty hardy, if you ask me. <laughs> well, I, I look pretty hardy, but I have the least hit points of anyone here. And it's only oh it's only one ninety five. <laughs> Yeah, I'm five. I'm five below Fox Neil, and he has. What doesn't he have? No, no, he has. Oh yeah, he has a plus to con now, doesn't he? Mm. I so everybody here coffee. is either built like a double wide truck or like a lamppost. Not really. <laughs> At this point, we're and all... then on you. on you. Tank. Gross. Graza takes the seat. He's not walking. <laughs> Makes sense. So, so wait. So Graza, Anya, Foxnail, and Arion are going to be in the cart. Yes. All right. 
uh, Ethan and Jack, so I mean, Ethan and uh, Nathan are going to be in the driver's seat, so I guess that means that Jackson and Yeldy are walking. Yep. Jackson can walk. All right. What was the speed of Luf and whenever they get on all fours? Plus, plus, ten, plus 10, 45. Oh, is it plus 10 now? Yeah, it's not. Oh, yeah. do they have 35 regularly? Yes, they have yeah. 35 regularly. Oh, oh okay. actually, y'all do your matches whenever one is on all fours then. Yeah. yeah. Oh, because I have the old sheet. Yeah, I got rid of that because I was like, yeah, this, this, Tabaxi already have that one down pat, so I'm not going to mess with that. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. Then it's plus. Okay, thank yeah. you. Mm -hmm. All right. So here's how we're going to do this. So it's five days of travel, correct? Mm hmm. Go to time is ominous. I'm going to put day one of five. Should I put on traveling music? Oh, yeah. if you wish, yes. All right. Anyone got a preference? We have nah. Uh, travel music. The kind that makes sound. Music that makes the air wiggle. Well, how about how about how, not, how about nostalgia for the, for those of you who actually played the series? Sure. <laughs> oh yes. Uh, oh no, Anya will be back. <sighs> no, no. And, and <laughs> here comes the copyright. Oh god. Oh wait, the the lady's not here. <laughs> oh no, we're gonna get copyrighted. <laughs> <laughs> no, the no, lady has joined the party. No, no, I mean because of the music. Because I remember. Oh yeah, that's right. Because because <laughs> um, Skyrim's soundtrack is copyrighted. Is it really? Yes. Specifically, whoever the artist is for it, they ha the pe YouTube has done it beforehand. All right, we have everybody We're all on sideways. <laughs> all right, everyone, fix themselves up. We don't and, have uh, here. Basically, what will happen is I will try to roll an encounter table. Just so yeah. often, each evening, if you you if you choose to set up camp, camp will happen, and uh, you might need some rolls for travel. Hi, yeah, car. Right. The script yeah, we need, a, we need Anya. I I stated that beforehand. Oh wait, Anya is not here. Oh no, Anya! I left Anya behind. We left Anya behind. <laughs> 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 Token noise. Jesus, Jesus. He's jexed. Oh, you turned the grid off, but you kept right it in a on. Second. Real roll, uh, real quick roll call. How many people has twenty strength? Half. No. Um, half. Twenty strength. I mean, no, twenty dex, twenty con. That's all the twenties I have. I have, uh, I have twenty. I have 20 strength, 20 wisdom. I have dex, uh, dex and, no, I'm sorry, con and wisdom. My dex should be. I don't have any 20s, but I have a 26. Yeah, you have a 26. I have and a 20 in strength, I have a 20 in dex, I have a 20 in constitution, I have a 20 in intelligence, I have a 20 in wisdom, I have a 20 in charisma. God damn it, yeah, Mr. All 20s. Yeah. This um, man just casually goes, I got a 20. We have the achievement, no. You're welcome. I have 20 Thank strength, you. 20 dex, 20 con, 20 intelligence, 9 wisdom, and 18 charisma. Wow, well, I know what you're not doing. <laughs> Succeeding <laughs> on wisdom saves? Yeah. Which, oh yeah, that's right, because Blood Under got shot. Right. Make a <laughs> wisdom save? Oh yeah, that's right, no! oh, yeah, that's right, because Blood Under got changed to being an imp base class. Yep. Thank, yeah. God, thank yep. God for that. Yeah, it was one of the moments... Oh. Among the one of Ethan's I stock playing Seth here is just that I would have changed just so much. Yeah. All right. There's the trial run. <laughs> oh, there you go. Right. Hi, there's your whiz save. <laughs> oh boy. Well, if some, I'll be lookout, I guess, with my 28 wisdom. I mean, 28. I mean, 28. Um, perception. Passive. Good lord. Uh, 25 for me. Yeah, I get a plus. I get a plus five from Lupin's getting advantage on hearing and smell checks, passive wise. Oh yeah, we do. I also have that, but not from the same thing you guys are getting like it from. Yep. And I have observed. So. It's also why I fast. Yep. 
The biggest woohoo I have in my uh, character sheet uh, uh, is plus 15 to dex saving throws. Nice. Alright. So, oh, wait. randomly, I'll choose randomly. Oh, wait, no. Probably not that one. I'd assume I'd also have a plus five to pass a perception from uh, Lupin. Yep, any loop, every single type of Lupin has a plus five. Okay, okay. Yeah, because I currently have a plus ten to uh, perception checks, but I never calculated my passive perception. Yep, ten plus ten plus your perception modifier. Oh, you're so good to it. Yeah, boy. For Vinskar, Nathan's gonna don his cloak of elven, his hood of the hood for the cloak of elven kind. I see. Uh, yeah. No, Virto just has his sword. <laughs> yeah, he uh, basically has all plus one equipment, but that's mostly because of his domain. Yeah. Nice. Uh, actually, to confirm, was it one rare and two? Uh, uncommon, or was it all? Oh. I think, I think it was each car. What? The the magic item thing was it one? Was it one where two uncommon and or three common? It's yeah. one rare or two uncommon or oh. three uncommon or three oh. common. Sure. All right. I would get okay. I mean, I still have plus that's so I can give anything a plus one. Makes sense. So I have a plus one plate, plus one long sword, plus one shield. Okay. <laughs> I guess. Well, what were we going to say before, oh, Car? I get to finally bring this out mm. the cards! Oh my god, not this again. I swear to god, if you pull a Nosk. <laughs> I swear to god. If, I swear to god, if you pull a Nosk. Okay, wait a second. I heard that the Nosk wasn't actually that problematic. It's not, it's just my annoying. <laughs> Does it just run all over the place? No, the problem is that the problem is that it summons a giant area of darkness that no one can see through. Oh. Be fine. Uh -oh. Dude, I did it for one hour. It's all chunky. Water. Yeah. I mean, it's better than heating up tea in a pot. See, that was just your fault. That was very stupid. Shut up. Jesus, car. Okay. It is. Currently snowing. I know it doesn't say that on this roll twenty map, but uh it's currently snowing. Snow. Alright. Um whoever's making a survival or nature check to keep on the path, he's doing so. Who here is good at survival? I or have nature. A plus 10. Anyone got a higher thing in either that or nature? Nope. Uh, um, I have a plus nine to nature. Well. All right, Jax has it. He does more than whack, apparently. What the fuck? Don't worry, this is not the, actually like, cringy. It's actually pretty. Twenty nine, nice. We have been fooled. The DC was thirty. We are now in the middle of the forest. <laughs> I swear to God. DC is 30. This is actually an ocean. So you were still on track.
Is that it, Car? I just want we're still on track? You know, I know I anyway. Alright. Alright. Um Hold on. Is he talking? No, he's typing in wall twenty. Oh, okay, sure. He said All we right. can converse amongst ourselves. Well, um So Strange question, but have you ever seen something that looks like the equivalent of a scaleless snake that can split its jaw in half? I saw a wolf that was like that. Uh, then I am on the wrong track. But, oh well. Well, a wolf that was able to split his jaw into like four different quarters and then set up and let out a sonic scream. <sighs> That's exactly what I'm looking for, but scale a snake. Huh. That sounds awful. It is. Doesn't sound so bad to what it could be. Sonic I scream, huh? Mm-hmm. That sounds pretty awful. Ooh. There is no river here. You just find a nice, like, kind of open space uh, to start set... To start fucking digging? I'm sorry. Right there. <laughs> nice open space to start putting a little camp in. Oh. Hold on. Yes. <sighs> <laughs> I suppose I'll keep watch for the group. I suppose I'll help set up camp, but also keep watch for the group. And uh, to make things go faster, there will be three watches instead of four. Really wish I made it to where Lupin's can trance, but eh. Right. Who is taking watches? I'll take the... I'll take I'll take the first watch. Okay. I'll take uh night because I do have dark vision. Legs. <laughs> well, it is, well, it is night right now, which is that it just doesn't show it on time of day. Yeah, you got like a eight to ten watch, or excuse me, an eight to twelve watch. Like a, it'd be three hours. Yeah, so it'd be eight to eleven, and then eleven to. Two and then two to five. I can take second watch. watch. All right. All right, boys. Which one of you is third shifting? Me. All right. Because so last Nathaniel. time I went fourth watch and I couldn't even see. <laughs> oh no! No, let's hope what's I don't get your, drunk. Uh, I don't have the health too. <laughs> what's your uh, What's your profanity? Um. I can't see this time roll. either. Well, we do have a campfire, hopefully. Oh, so, are we Jax, rolling now? You are the oh. randomly selected person to have a 1d100 yeah. roll. Please roll that oh, now. I, I, have, I have another thing I want to do. Oh, what is it you want to do? Um, I'm going to use the... Uh, actually, how like how far like would you say the light from the campfire goes? Okay. The light from the campfire goes? Yeah. Uh, I'd say... Twenty feet out. Uh, small Twenty feet? Okay. Uh, uh, then my thing like wouldn't do anything. Kind of like a torch, then. Yeah. yeah. Actually, hmm. No, that wouldn't work, because it's too to me. Okay, never mind. The rule is that trippy <laughs> with the grid. Can I get it on my phone? <laughs> okay, so what 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 am I doing, Car? Uh, uh, roll a D one hundred to see. If there's oh, good God! Two hundred ninety one. Hmm. Yes, I see. Interesting. It's a Tarask. 
Intelligible risk. Oh, come on. I'm just going to be rolling some in in encounters from the cold thing, so it's fine. It's a Tarask. It's only a Tarask. Um, Alright, first watch. Man. Nathaniel, please roll. Alright, uh. Da -da 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 -da, for the better. Da -da -da -da. Okay, so that was a. 31. A 31. Alright. I'll tell you what happens on your evening. Are you guys having fun there? <laughs> yes. Yes, have it. Oh, well, I have to say, um, mm. <laughs> can I make it out? Uh, yeah. I, I'll, I'll go to the house Yeah, right hold now. on. I actually left this place, so I... But I... Yeah, my... Oh! I'm back. Hi, back. Hello. I'm dead. Hello! We're, we're setting up camp for the night. Nathan's taking first watch. Oh, okay. You find... A trap! No, JK. Yeah, but... My... What the hell is this doing here? Where was it pointed towards? I, I don't... I, don't, I just... Yeah, doing... Hmm. Is there a place on the dirt where it, where it kind of looks like it was placed before? Wow, okay, it's time to go yeah. home. <laughs> where? Like, can I like see like where it was placed and try to figure out like where that where it was pointed? Roll investigation. All right. Uh, my investigation is a plus eight. Uh, that's twelve. Twelve. Um, do you feel like it was it, it was planted not far from where it is now? It was facing up north. What direction is our camp in? Uh, our uh, our camp is actually facing north, so it'd be roughly on a. It was it would have been planted here on a sort of hillside, and it was face and it was facing this way. Huh. Oh, no, Are there any footsteps or footprints? Okay. Yeah. Uh. Well. Mm, they're not as deep. They're not deep enough for you to determine that what type of thing was here. No, There's just, one more thing were they recent? Know, and that, uh, no. Uh, you could tell that from the age of the item you found. You could mm -hmm. also tell that the item you found was smashed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna bring it to camp. Okay. Add that to the inventory, I suppose. Just to, just to, just to hold on to it. Maybe I'll repair it and try to see if I can find whoever it belonged to. Hmm. Which is funny since I since I already have a spy glass, so it's like, yeah, this is just a plus. Yeah, <laughs> nice. All right, next up, who's next? Hello, I am next Hello. watch. Please roll. You roll that perception check. Twenty-seven. Holy shit! Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, hold yeah, on. I, Let me I, tell you I, what happens during your evening. Who was last to watch? Me, Nathan. Uh, when are we unlocking Eyeball? I was going to say, imagine all three Lupin are just <laughs> three watches. I think we are. <laughs> I have unlocked my no, no, no. third Lupin oh, no, eye. I know, oh, it's... Um... <laughs> it's vulnerable, God. We had to get one person in there with bad perception. <laughs> uh, Jack Jax isn't gonna watch for us. Alright. Uh, 
ninth. Who is oh, third? No. I don't think it me. I don't think it really <laughs> changes anything if multiple people are on a watch, though. Other than they can talk to each other. I would probably be like dead night because I have dark vision. Hmm. Please come with me during my watch. I have minus one perception. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I, I have plus ten. Ah, finally. Someone help us, <laughs> man. Alright. Please roll perception, boys. Hooray! <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> Yeldir does not even see our campfire. <laughs> Yeldir does a hard time finding things, but... Meta Sword. Or er, not Meta Sword. Uh, oh, fuck it. <laughs> Raza, you do know this. Yeldir and Graza. All right, so. Tim. Can I please? Thank you. Check it. Oh, it's. Can any of you help me guess this? Okay. Oh, let's see here. Second, twenty round guard. So, uh, you adventure for a living? Uh, me? No. no. Yeah. I work a forge for a living. Oh, I see. I'd imagine that 20 car. <laughs> oh, you're fine. Don't worry about it. Plus 10 as well. Ah, oh, that's his whiz so... save. <laughs> that's, that's my perception score. Well, can you see How... <laughs> okay, wait, hold on. Hi, explain to me. How with minus one perception do I have plus ten wisdom saves? It makes sense, I swear. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Are you more of an uh, armor smith or weapon smith? Every smith. Every Smith. Yes. What yes, power? I am also a uh, John Smith. Does it feel kind of hot to you? No. Uh, he has resistance, so no. <laughs> resisted? Yeah, I'm resistant to fire. Oh. When I think of that. I used to be able to shake off lightning. Not anymore, but I could. Salaf, this is fucking beautiful. <laughs> I never Play is making abstract art. <laughs> and why would you trade that for whatever? Or did you trade it for something? I guess, but it wasn't my choice. Huh. I guess I can understand that. I'm back, Alright, is that it? Actually, tell you what, look at this. And then he like shows you the ends of his fingers and there are scars along each one. <laughs> he rolls up his sleeves and he's covered in burns and yeah. scars. Cuts. He doesn't have sleeves. <laughs> He does have scars on the ends of his fingertips, though. Uh, my, yeah, my guy is covered. In oh, you did? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I thought you were making fun of me. I was like, hey. <laughs> or rather, he takes off his clothes because he technically doesn't wear sleeves. So, <laughs> he takes off his cloak and, like, reveals, like, like ham-sized arms covered in just burns and scars. Well, it's about to be really horrifying if you can do this. And then some claws protrude from the scars. That is really horrifying. <laughs> uh, no, I can't do that. Good to hear. Because uh, it would definitely be a lot more frightening on you. No offense. 
Okay. And then the scars retract and there are little holes in his fingertips. I can do this, and he creates a radiant, a radiant bomb in his hand. A flame. Almost sacred. Yeah, yeah, you find it. Can't say I've ever been in tune with magic, but... Well. Or is that magic at all? Oh, it's ma- it is magic, just magic gained from my god. Ah. <laughs> uh. Who does he worship, is the question. Yeah, uh, mm. Ironically, I worship Morden. <laughs> See, that'd be funny if you were an orc, but it's still not still funny nonetheless. Yes. <laughs> Morden, god of basically god of war in the forge for the dwarves. Beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> At least, I just wanted he's not only a, a hobgoblin cleric; he's a high level hobgoblin cleric. Specifically, an archbishop. He's basically he, he is an archbishop, which you would mention, grudgingly. <laughs> are you talking to him out of character, or are you saying you would mention that to me? Yeah, he he mentioned he doesn't really say what he is, but he'll mention he's a high-ranking member of the Warden uh, Church. Well, I can't say I'm anyone particularly important, but I am a member of the Sword of Justice. Yes, I've heard of them. I hate my title. Uh, what's your t- title? The Titan of Miglia, he says kind of grudgingly. Uh, Shut up! <laughs> yeah. I don't have any problem with it, Carr, but Yeldir does. Oh, okay. Which uh, extends his hand as Archbishop of the Forge. I lost connection. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, he said Archbishop of the Forge. Well, I already <laughs> introduced myself, but he shakes your hand. <laughs> yeah, he shakes his extends hand and shake, shake it. Also, I said I would take this watch, but I can't see shit. Uh, yeah, that's why I woke up, because I kind of figured that. My eyes are a bit on the small side. Oh, I can see in the dark. I can as well. I... Also not typical of my kind. Well, you'd love the firebrand, then. Well, actually, no, I think uh, Lupin can see the dark, right? Yes. Yeah. So, it, it, yes, typical of your kind, just maybe not quite like everyone else. All right. With that, uh, we're going to wake up, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Yep. It is dawn of the new day. Day two, specifically. <sighs> so, let me go fix that accordingly. Day two out of five. It is currently day. Everyone is now awaken. I'm going to need a new D20, uh, D100 roll, please. And the person of choice today is... Da, 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 da. Yeah. Roll a D100 for me. If you screw us over, it's your fault. Oh, no pressure. Right. <laughs> I'm gonna blame you, Karn, no matter what. <laughs> blame the die. Blame the die. So, a D100? Mm-hmm. Car. Okay. Twenty-six. Twenty-six. Okay. I'm just put that in here and note that. 
So you guys uh, begin the dawn of a new day, Mr. Day, two out of five. Happy day. And uh, Ethan uh, goes out into the forest and starts whacking a tree. Is he what? Okay. It doesn't look like he's practicing. Yes. <laughs> Who's? Is it any particular style he's using? When will is, the tree, uh, tree violence end? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by like what type of style? Yeah. Like what type of fighting is like what type of fighting style or stance is he using? Like is it any particular one that I would that I that I uh that I can tell? Um Roll history. Alright. Um plus eight history. Nice. Uh, that's a 18. Hmm. Yeah, so he, he, his fighting style is that. Of, hmm. How do I say this? It is something similar to yours. It does seem like his strikes are a bit more towards the aggressive side. I'm just gonna watch. Yeah, so I'm gonna stand back and I'm just gonna watch him. Hmm. Bonk. Good. Anyone else waking up to ash and dust? I wipe my ass and I slap my nuts. <laughs> Sorry. I'll just do the last part. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. The last this part. Doesn't wipe. <laughs> <laughs> Roll the slap nuts. Oh no. <laughs> yes. I, I've woken up. I, I'm awake. Yes, Just awake. Uh, Fox Neil is getting himself a bowl of grits. Grits. I think Nathan will make grits. I think, I think Nathan will try to make breakfast for everybody. Oh, Food. Hello. Oh, God. I think I'm <laughs> still proficient in cooking tools. It may be a bit late to bring this up, but I was used to being taller than people usually. Oh, go, go to this is a strange experience, and he's like doing the hand thing where he's comparing his height with someone. Yeah, go to consider to live with more. Uh, <laughs> I guess it means that uh, Miglians are typically smaller than the average person. <laughs> I uh, recommend going to Capra or uh, or Fokia if you want people shorter than you. Yeah, uh, yes. Garaza Verte will say, like, you know, considering I live with dwarves, it's a common occurrence for me. I don't know. Normally, I would be stuck within a giant castle of some sort, or keep. Why? Why? Not that I'm complaining. Why would you be kept in a keep? I'm a Sorry, blood hunter. The internet machine broke. So? Don't they send you out to hunt monsters and the like? Well, I'm not going to say that normally I'm outside. <clears throat> I'm saying my place of staying is a keep. Mm, must be nice. You know, we all have a keep. <sighs> you know, Anya has a keep. Elbows Anya. <laughs> oh yeah, the volcano. Oh, Foxy was saying that. Oh yeah, the volcano. Yes. A whole volcano? Yes, um... Oh, that's right. They don't know. <laughs> Nathan says, <laughs> says, he, says he wears his head. Oh, that's right. <laughs> you live in a volcano. Uh, uh, he, he, he looks at Anya. Do you want to? Do you want to say? Oh, I live in a volcano. Too. That's not that good. That's oh, I see. <laughs> Anya, do you want to say or? I see. Uh, no, nah, I'll surprise him. All right, cool. Uh, surprise. Uh, okay, I'll keep my mouth shut then. Same. That sounds less than appealing. Oh, don't worry. It'll, <laughs> don't worry. It'll be great. Uh, it's, uh... Oh, my God. Love is great for forging. Yeah, it is. Not great when you have it's fur. It sounds it's a bit warm. A 
I don't deal particularly well with heat. I'm a uh, I'm... Bit, bit more kind of custom to these cold temperatures. And that goes... I have uh, some resistance to flame from my worship. <laughs> as someone who lives, as someone who's been to the south before, I don't recommend it. I'm about to walk. The desert sucks. <sighs> that's, how, that's, that's how we kill him. All right. All right. I'm gonna make breakfast for the. I'm gonna make breakfast for everybody. Oh. Ethan gets back after around thirty minutes to forty-five minutes. I kind of say, I kind of say, I kind of say in loop. And how's your training? How'd your training with the tree go while making breakfast? Sorry, I'm waiting for my <laughs> It went fine. Or, it went fine. Excuse me. Noted. Surprised you don't train as much anymore. I guess you're a oh, well finished. Oh, uh, well, guess you're well equipped. So oh, no. Oh, no, I still train. And then he motions over to Anya. What? I train with her. Oh. Good sparring partner. Yeah. Perhaps we could do that sometime. <laughs> you see Nathan okay. you see Nathan just have a grin on his face when he hears that as he looks over at Anya. So if I don't kill him. He says in, he says in Dwarfish, please don't kill my brother. For you. <laughs> Alright, is... While we're waiting, I think anybody it's up for a game of cards? Oh. I'm up for it. It's best if we do that on the road. Well, I can't do that from outside the carriage. I could walk for a bit if you're... Oh, fuck! They both the play! <laughs> no! Oh, not again. We have a not double again. party. Not again! Not the double party! <laughs> I can walk a oh, bit no, for, uh, to give you a break. <laughs> I'll be fine. Alright, we will now begin noon. I apparently put a great sword in my inventory, but I don't know why I would do that when I don't use weapons. Travel the lonely road, the only one that I have ever known? I'm going this to need survival checks, please. It's the only one. Let's go yeah. again. The um, food um, is delectable. Nothing too like amazing, but nothing horrible. On top of that, I'd like to say before I was trying to say this before Zenby rolled, but I'm going to give him advantage with my mastermind feature. Okay. Of course, that's better. I walk this road, Lee Road, the only road car. that I have ever rode. Uh, 23. All right. Nothing of particular interest, although uh, you do see some small creatures darting in and out of the bushes to look at you. Do we notice? What? Do we notice? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Oh, Can I roll nature to see if I recognize them? Sure. Uh... Okay. Not 20, 28. Ah, uh, yes. These are some what we like to call day raiders. They're um, a bunch of kobolds that usually would go out and raid. Uh, and raid unsuspecting travelers. However, this party seems way too well equipped for that, and they know when to not attack. So they're just looking instead. Yeah, uh, you said that's kobolds, right? Have you yeah, kobolds. Yeah. Okay, I kind of saying uh, I kind of look at all of them and then look at Anya for a little bit before looking back at them. They're more or less now, I guess, either staring either in awe or in fear. And it's like best to save this for another day. <laughs> that. <laughs> Does he deer play his cards? Easily, please. Oh, I'm still outside the carriage. Bruh. Carriage moment. Is there any discussions uh, oh. you all wish to have with each other? Well, Nathan's gonna Sorry. drink. 
Oh, sorry. I was going to say Nathan's just going to drink with Anya. There's oh. a tree ahead. Awesome. There's a tree ahead. Oh, yeah, shit. <laughs> that was supposed to be a trap that they were going to set. But, uh, you know, you will smush them. So. <laughs> They realize, nah, nah, we good, we good, we out. It ain't worth it. It ain't worth it. <laughs> this ain't it, chief. This ain't it. You know what I imagine that like they move the tree out of our way. Yeah, that's what they do. They just move the tree. <laughs> they move the tree. Yes. I was going to move it myself if somebody else wanted to help. <laughs> Burn the tree. The kobolds be like. <laughs> It ain't worth it. <laughs> it ain't worth it. It's not a good thing. Nah, that ain't it, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Jack. It ain't worth it. You're big. Want to give me a hand? Okay. <laughs> oh, no, he turned around. Bum, 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 bum. So, the, so we're trying to get the tree up? They look the same. Okay, let me see how sharp my sword is still. So. Actually, wait, hold up. Wait, you have 20 strength, right, Zenvu? Huh? Yeah, it's not going to be that yeah, hard I to pick it up. I want to I wanna try to see how much health this tree has, because I do max damage objects. All right. God. I was about to say, because like, you can lift 300, you can lift 300 pounds, I think? Uh, I think I can lift like 1,200. Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm talking about like, oh, yeah, double carrying capacity. Forgot about that. Yep, I have Brawny. So I can help with that. Feeding Fawny. Okay. Yeah, I guess we lift the tree. Lift with your legs. Three, two, one. Strength. Strength four? Um, sure. I think, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> and before the double that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. If it's a double nat one, I'm going to slap both of you. Oh, wow, that's pretty bad still. <laughs> you know, you're struggling to get the whole tree, but with uh, Graz, oh, excuse me, Jax and Graz's help, definitely get that uh, that tree moving. They move it over to the side. Gonna use the excuse I'm at the end? <laughs> hey, the Kyle just wants to about Anya. Yes, remember, when you, remember when you, me, and Stephanie were used to do that? You should try to do that. Do what? Lift, some, lift something out the way. Psst, try. We still do it. Well, I do. <laughs> yeah, Stephanie is gone, I and still got it. Stephanie is gone, and Nate's gone. So I'll I'll be the muscle in, in this relationship. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that was ever in question. I don't see either of you moving the tree. All right, way. I'll do it. Stand aside. <laughs> it's already moved, moved. though. <laughs> uh, I was still moving it because I was like, "Y'all taking this long to move a damn tree?" Yeah, I'm like, come on, like, come on, like, really? This is taking this long? Just she takes yeah. it, just throws it. Rustling sound in the distance as it rolls down the hill. Wonder what the wonder what the others are up to. All right. And uh, that's so, about it for the day, if you guys want to set up camp. That'll work. All right. So, but before, before we rest for the night, I'm going to ask Ethan, so, where'd you learn my style from? Your style? Ethan, Ethan stands up, <laughs> Ethan motions, to, Ethan, Ethan kind of like motions with his katana. I was watching you. I was watching you, and I saw a bit of my style in there. Yelled, you're just straight out leaving. <laughs> Fuck this. <laughs> He's out of here, dude. He did go over there. I mean, I'm a, I'm gonna bounce out. Also, the new campfire is over here by Yeldir, So thank you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> he was. I'm gonna just use this brown piss. thing. <laughs> As a, <laughs> whoops. I mean. <laughs> Whoops. There we go. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna ask, "Where'd you learn my?" Guys... Yeah. Sorry. No. Go ahead. I'll continue. I was just gonna describe the scene. You guys are coming, and uh... oh, by the way, it was a sunny day. Oh, and it kind of melted all the snow away as you guys went on, went along. This and, is uh, this is rare. You guys tend to 
come across a small river of sorts that's starting to build up. And you mentioned uh, Ethan's fighting style. Mm-hmm. There's pieces of mine in there. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it was inherent. There's a bit of it that may have been inherent. <laughs> well, I, was... did, I did hear dear old dad was a bit of a master swordsman before he disappeared. Before they took him away. Yeah, that. Hmm. You ever try to find him? I did. Hmm. No luck, though. Yeah, same. The most I heard is that they shipped him out west. And then, and I'm we sure know he's fine. And we know what happened out west. Hmm. I'm sure he's fine, though. Yeah. If there's anything like yeah, us, he journeyed yeah. to it. Sorry. Really? Really? <laughs> uh, Felix Felix would be so disappointed. <laughs> uh, I'm sure he would be. It's okay. We're making him proud. Mm-hmm. Press your shoulder and kind of smiles. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. Do you remember any of the uh, old songs your mom used to sing to us? <laughs> oh my goodness, I still have those memorized. I still have those memorized at this point. I remember, I remember, I remember after I left, I kept writing them down over and over again so I wouldn't forget. Hey, he kind of pulls up like sort of a a crumpled notebook of sorts that kind of has some of the writing in it. <laughs> <laughs> of course, of course. Uh, yeah. Gotta keep yourself company once in a while. Sure. Uh, for me, music will do it. How's mom been? She's been alright. She's been alright. Hmm. Uh, yeah. And the other little ones? Oh, I guess not so little anymore. Uh, I don't know. I'd say they're fine. <laughs> mm, ha- haven't seen them? <laughs> They've, they've all gone to do their own things. But your five bucks, they'll still show up if mom sends a letter saying saying to have a family dinner. <laughs> yes, yes, that is true. It's usually in the late months she does it too. I uh, guess we don't have to worry about that for a while. Mm, yeah. But when you do it, you better bring the big turkey. Um, I have the money for it. It seems, it seems. <laughs> it seems a bit and all, because uh, I do want to note that what he is wearing is what he is wearing. Okay. Who? Oh, you mean <laughs> a very well-off individual. Yeah, no, he's not a very well-off individual. Uh, yeah, the adventuring life is not... I got lucky. Before, I was pretty destitute. It's... What happened? How did you get lucky? Ran it. Well, I ran into her. He motions to Anya, and then I ran into it. And then I ran into the guy that owns this en- that owns this entire province now. You ran into the guy that owns all of Torzok. Mm, no, Falowski. Oh, oh, that guy. Yeah. He was interesting. Oh, was he? I'm sure, he's quite a character. <sighs> Very. I had some issues with I had some issues with him, but it's all water under the bridge now. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, all this can be water under the bridge as well. It was open. Yes, you can, Zalif. Go ahead, brother. I can't. So, so bad. Thank you. You find Barry. Yes. You find How much berry? Strawberries. I love strawberries. Let's go. <laughs> That's it. That's all I'm going to put in my inventory is just strawberries. <laughs> it's all oh. strawberries. 100 oh, pounds man. of strawberries. This is a strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> this is Excuse berry. Me, Arianne going up to a punch. This is a strawberry. This is very good. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Oh, God. What? You didn't notice my <laughs> You didn't notice my Klaus pun? Where was your Klaus pun? It's all water under the bridge. I'm going to fucking beat you with the Klaus stick, dude. <laughs> I got it. I got the... I'm... Is that how it's going on? Or... 
I got cuffs on a stick right right here. Ow. Good job. Guys. That's it. I'm, I'm I'm taking this with me. I found strawberries. Anyone want some strawberries? I would love some strawberries. Toss awesome, me a few. Oh, yes, I'm a huge fan of them. I just pass the. I don't know what I'm holding these in. I assume like a bag. Yeah, small little pass the bag. pass the bag of strawberries around. Hmm. Pass the the room. How much is it? How much? Wait, how much? How much effort do you think it would take to make jelly out of character or jam? I don't know, Zalif. How much effort was it? <laughs> <laughs> um, with cooking tools, probably not that bad. Not not that bad. I'll say because I could. If you have like water and berries, that's basically all you need because berries have a lot of natural sugar. Just cook it down in like a bowl we're or a pot. River, river, no? right? Well, we're by a river and I have a campfire <laughs> and we have a campfire, so. Anyone want to need some strawberry jam? <laughs> well, sure. Yes. I have returned. Sounds delicious. We've done it. All right. Hey, uh, yell dear. That's a fucking another nat twenty. Twenty-three. Oh. Strawberry jam achieved. Oh, did did you come back like in character or out of character? <laughs> Both. Mm -hmm. Nathan, oh, just taking this log back with me. Jam. Hey, yell dear. You want some strawberries or strawberry jam? <laughs> Does it taste like strawberry? Yes. Yes. I wonder. I'd be uh more. Concerned if strawberries didn't taste like strawberries. Car, can I actually take that log with me? You're taking a whole tree. <laughs> what do you mean? I think, That's not a whole tree. I think he means the log here. <laughs> oh, sure. Mine. It's got some fungus growing on it. Oh, I'm sure. Spoil. You have log <laughs> with fungus. Yes. I'm sure. Oh, some tree. mushrooms. Can I uh, take a look at those? <laughs> Uh, sure. I just wanted the log. Wouldn't wouldn't you know it? He really would. Just, he really just wanted the log. I'm going to eat. Get out. Because I, I I rolled a seventeen on nature to try to identify the mushroom. Yes, they're the common Torzokian shroom. They're called uh Hmm. How should I call these? The Torzokian half pints. Yes. They're called the Torzokian half pints because what? you can actually make the, the you can actually harvest milk from these. It's oh. a kind of a painful process, but yes, this these mushrooms have milk in it. Mushroom milk, very rare commodity if you know how to make it. So if you make mushroom stew with this, it's just cereal. <laughs> <laughs> but is but isn't soup just cereal? And stew just cereal. <laughs> <laughs> isn't cereal just soup? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't cereal generally include milk? Also, uh, Zalif, Not the broth. berries were over here, so that you know. What? The berries were over here where I'm pinging, so that. Oh you know. yeah, I can see them. Berries. Yeah. <laughs> berries. Also, I just want to ask this. Um, I want to ask this real quick. Uh, Jax, is he from Seth Near's tribe exactly, or is he just from a nearby tribe? Jax? Senvu? Hi. Senvu? Is, Hi. Ja is Jax from the same clan as Sethne, or is he just from nearby? I think I think you'd be from the same same one. Uh, you would have been at that party, probably. Oh, uh, I mean, I guess he's gonna... Oh. I guess, yeah. I guess, I guess, or at least he was a... Uh, okay, so you know when you were going there, those guards? Yeah. He, he was probably one of those. Oh, okay. Yeah. He's gonna ask Jax... Uh, yeah. plan produces something different. Has has a tendency to produce more of one thing. Uh, except this clan has a tendency to have a high population of eye. blood hunters. Hmm. I guess anything else, but it is, but produce and any blood hunter that is, any anyone who wants to become a blood hunter joins the blood hunter clan. Essentially. Wow. Yeah. wow okay. Gotcha. You don't have, to, don't have to kill me. Or they, they train me. with blood hunters. Look. <laughs> We can, we can talk to Sam. Don't kill okay. me. I think I think okay. I think I'd look at Zen. I think I look at Jax and I ask. So, how's the tribe been lately? Relatively peaceful. Is that crack in the sky still there? 
Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The cracks in the sky don't really disappear that fast. There's got to be a way to see that at least. Oh, it's out. Well, I mean, it doesn't really bother anybody. Looks kind of pretty. <laughs> What'd you say, Sam? <laughs> Wish spell. I'm gonna. Yes. I'm kidding. But. Gonna suck on I do levels yeah, from I'm now. A really weird a, a Royal Boyalis. Okay, wait. Something is throwing me for a loop here. How is. Anya on the correct grid, but nobody else is. <laughs> I'm just too powerful. Be <laughs> because, because, because the actual grid is invisible. I, I, I physically cannot be on the same horizontal axis as Anya. It's because of the, it's because he's it's because he's using it's because the actual grid's invisible for us. <laughs> oh, wait, now Anya can no longer get into a no, square. Anya is no, Anya is probably from You ruined hated. your square. Because when he no. copy and paste it, throws you off the grid. So I can't get caught from that. Hold alt to not snap the grid. Alt? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I have become all powerful. That's kind of that's kind of disgusting. Not gonna lie. Car, we can finally be, be on the grid. I'm sorry, I can't align the squares with the squares, dude. <laughs> uh, yeah, Car, when you're setting it up, just hold yeah. alt when you to resize the thing. Uh, did you tr did someone color out the name down there? Hold up. Yes. <laughs> there will be no watermarks in my server. You realize there's a reason why there's water marks, water watermarks, right? These maps are brought to you by Crosshead. Maybe Thank you, Crosshead. <laughs> um. <laughs> Anyways, uh, so it's nighttime. I need a. Uh, D100 rolled, and the person who's going to roll it is going to be... No, please. Nighttide, are you here? What? He's not here by the I game. I am here now. Let's go! Go ahead. Do it. Let's go. Go on, Nighttide. Roll, roll the 100. D100 for me. A D100? Oh, yeah. Shit. Uh... Oh. <laughs> I see. Ah, uh, yes. Blood flies. <laughs> so you have we chosen... Blood flies. We get jumped by <laughs> Tiamat. <laughs> she's, still, oh, right. she's still in the first layer of hell. Thank God. <laughs> All right. So uh, we may now begin our watches for the evening. Oh, I'll take I'll take the last one. Okay. I can go first watch this time Third around. Third watch again. Are you Maintaining that sleep schedule. I'll oh, I guess you I'll take midnight watch. All right, I'm taking the third one, so I guess I'm hanging out with uh, with uh, Yeldir. Yeldir. Fox Neil will take a second watch with Grasa. Out of curiosity, does anyone recognize his name? Nope. Ah. Uh. Sad. All right, it's first watch. Kind of basic. Arion. Hey. All right. Uh, please roll for me. <laughs> oh my oh, god, man. I rolled terribly. <laughs> 13. <laughs> Nothing of note happens during your watch. Wonderful. That you know. <laughs> Nothing of note happens that you notice. Yeah, if I have an attack on you, oh, rest in peace, my dude. <laughs> All right. I get murdered, but I don't find out. You get murdered, but you don't find out. Night Tide gets to join the game as the I biggest do. blood fly you've ever seen. No! <laughs> <laughs> it's just like Squat Punchers on the siege all over again. <laughs> Nosh, right. but he's a blood fly. Uh, second watch. Bruh. Second watch. Uh, Fox Neil and Graza, you both wake up. Fox Neil kind of pokes a spear in the sand and or spear in the dirt and starts drawing on it. Uh, roll your perception check, please. Hmm, Meta Sword. Let's see. Hey, I was just 
<laughs> so. Fox Neil kind of points out in the distance, hey, that's a unique looking rune there. Hmm, what? A tree, and he kind of points to the small tree up front. It's got a rune there. Uh, Graza stands up and takes a look at it. It seems to be in a language you don't truly understand. Uh, can't read it. Yeah, can't read it either. But, uh... Can read what that does. Magically, at least. It's a glyph of warning. Now, why would that be on a tree? Uh, that is strange and concerning. It's best we do something about it. Don't want to trigger it now. Yes. Mm. Well, do you wish to do anything with it? I'm just going to let people know about it. Uh, no. Yes, All uh, right. Form. Fair enough. Uh, the when the next two wake up, Fox Neil will let you know about the warding, uh, the glyph of warding on that tree. Yeah. All right. Yell, dear Nathaniel. Please roll perception. All right. Uh, Enjoy. Not that bad. Thirty. Fifteen. Thirty and fifteen. All right. You notice some large creatures across the river walking in the distance. Can, I, can we tell what they are? Stumbling along. Yes. Uh, with a 30, you can tell that they are a group of uh, giants. Hill giants. Oh, ah, uh, shit, 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 shit. Hold up. Uh... Damn it, I don't know Giant. Ah, that's disappointing. I know Giant. Wanna speak to him? Is there any reason to? Why not? Just, I mean, Hill Giants aren't mean. I mean, Hill Giants, Hell Giants aren't usually that mean. I mean, they, they don't look like they'd attack us, do they, Car? No, they are pulling around some rather large, monstrous sized creatures, though. Hmm. I wonder if they some found that. Mistake. And some cyclopses. Wait, 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 cyclops! <laughs> yeah. That's a giant! <laughs> yeah. They're pulling him around. Are they gonna eat him or. Because when I thought, when you said pulling around massive monsters, I thought you were like they were pulling around like their food. Uh, they're pulling some food around, some herding animals, and some cyclopses. Hmm. Oh, then. I think it's best we just leave them you alone. You look worried. What's the matter? Nothing. Nothing. I just noticed that they were carrying Cyclops with them, and I just found it interesting. Oh. I actually met a giant. I actually, I actually met a giant tribe before once. Uh, I mostly know the language just because I read it. <laughs> I couldn't read it, especially in a giant book of giant. Hmm. Well, they seem to be too far away to cause a rumble large enough to bother the rest of the party. My god. Still have to make Nathaniel's ears twitch, probably. Yes, for sure. Yeah. So, what exactly did you come all the way to Tizokia for from Miglia? Technically, I told you why. Hmm. Sure, you, know, you were searching for something, but what? Scale of snake. Four jaws. <laughs> why do you want it? Well, money. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is how I make a living. True. I'm surprised. I'm surprised, though. Saying that you're a blood hunter and that you're trying to make money, I expect you to be looking for something else. 
Like, mm, well, this is how far have you gotten into Tokyo? Is this the farthest you've gotten? Uh, I would not actually know that out of character. Car. Right. Mm -hmm. Is this the farthest inland he's gone into Tozokia? Well, not inland. The farthest he's gone into to into Tozokia. Sure, I'd say so. I feel like he's kind of fresh off the boat. Well, then. Yeah, it's mostly uncharted territory for me. Well, you're probably gonna find this out the next time you visit a major city, but there's a huge bounty out for looking for someone. Oh, I see. Mm-hmm. Have you? Though. So, Typically, I'm more so after monsters than people. True. I'm after... True. I'd usually be the same way, but I kind of need this person. What for? Also... I ought to kill, uh, ought to kill someone. Bonabold? I won't pry that far, uh. I guess. <sighs> I mean, it's not much to say. I mean, I'm an adventurer. We usually try to kill someone. That's fair. Well, this one's a bit, though. I guess this one, this one's kind of like what you Swords of Justice faced out west a little bit. Out west. You know, the whole Lich King. That's still run. That's still running around. I still don't have a lot of knowledge out of character. I know. I know. I'm doing this. I'm doing this in character as a way to. I never actually got to be personally involved. <sighs> From what I heard, it was a whole big shindig. That's what's. Ugh, then, well, I can't. Exa I can't exactly say that I was. That I'm glad for it, because that's what led to the blood under hunting me down. I don't imagine that would happen to be my business, and you would just tell it to me. Well, it's not like. Well, you're a blood hunter for one, and second of all, that bounty's long gone, so it's not like it matters. Uh. If anyone's still after, if anyone's still hunting me down for a bounty, eleven years old, I think at this point they're either dead or going to soon to be dead. <laughs> Depends on which one they want. Yeah. Well. Hey, if I get crushed, you wouldn't happen to try and take whatever's crushing me off, would you? you, guys should if, you happen to get, if you happen to get crushed, I'd try to help you. All right, great. I'm gonna go try and lift that rock. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so this is what it's so this is what it's like seeing Nate in physical form. <laughs> yep. Oh, wholesome. I just watch him go try to lift up a rock. All right, strength. Oh, I'm gonna try it. Rock, 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 rock. Uh, athletics or strength? <laughs> Car. Athletics. Twenty-three. Twenty-three? Yeah, you lift it up with a uh, pretty good uh, ability. And he starts doing squats with it because he's. <laughs> Make a straight tape t t for every check, for every squat. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, he reminds me of you, all right, Nate. Hmm. He's just trying to stay in shape. <laughs> uh, still, still, still miss your buddy. Yeah, why would I say? If he failed, he was gonna start pumping the log, by the way. <laughs> oh my god. Well, that's all I have for the rest of the rest. All right. Dawn of a new day. Ba -do 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 -do. All right. Um, you guys. Ethan is going back to his training as usual, and it's the dawn of a new day. Seems he's already made some breakfast for you. 
I like how uh, the watermark has been replaced with just car. <laughs> it's just car. <sighs> Wait, it's all car? Always has been. <laughs> Boy. Uh, to finish up, I'm going to toss this boulder as far as I can that way. But fine. <laughs> Alright, you toss boulder, and it goes like a good 10 feet, and then sploosh! Sploosh! And the water goes, it hits back at you. Which, I mean, cools you down again, so that's kind of nice. Yeah. And now to trudge back. Mm. So was every, so what's everyone's drink of choice exactly? Whiskey. <laughs> fruit salad. Wait, that ain't a drink. Um fruit <laughs> only if you're a coward. <laughs> yes, I like to drink a smoothie fruit salad. <laughs> <laughs> If you like pina coladas, try Mississippi Queen. Mississippi Queen. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> you're gonna make that? No, I'm not. No. I'm not making that. I'm sure Anya probably keeps it in a in a in a, in a tight casket to a tight casket to herself. If you know what I mean. <laughs> does, Anya, does Anya have some Mississippi Queen on her? Is the question. Send a little ask. <laughs> Bruh, crazy. Look, she dude, she, dude, dude, she's immune to getting drunk. She can just hard chug that and not have to worry about anything. Like, I... Yeah. <laughs> A functioning alcoholic. Right, like, I'm still walking around. I'm not drunk. Can't yeah. get drunk. Oh, yeah, fuck, you're immune. Yep. Hell yeah. You're like the but you're no longer immune to the poison damage. <laughs> what? Rude. You can't take that back. Yeah. He took back my he took back my awesome blink step, so I think he can. Uh, yeah, dude, sad. not gonna lie, that blink step was really hurting me. <laughs> that was hilarious. Thank you very much. <laughs> Fucking 3d8 plus 27 damage. You had your fun. No, no, not 3d8. 98 plus 27. Yeah, I was about to say, I don't think 3d8 would have Taken down an entire phase of someone. Yeah, ninety-eight. God, that was amazing. Whatever. Now I can. Now I'll just do that per head. Uh, good times. Meanwhile, Tim, what you're talking about? You're gonna be a wizard. That means you get to do that consecutively. I know. Good times. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we should once again get back on the road. I don't, I don't even know. Uh, I'll, um, I'll, I'll, uh, eh, I'll walk ahead of the caravan. Okay. I'll kind of scout ahead with my, scout ahead while using my cloak of elven kind to make it to where it's harder to see me. Uh, DM, do you a question, Kar? No, she's going to read it out loud. He's not. I have a question. <laughs> Sure. Can I rob <laughs> Arion? <laughs> Arion, make a perception check. No, JK. <laughs> Lord. And today's rolling, 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 roll person roll is Nightight. Are you still here? You, you want to roll? Hi. Oh, Nightight's rolling roll? again. Let's go. I mean, honestly. What, another D100? Yeah, hit me. Okay. Uh -oh. Um, okay, <laughs> cool. Here we go. <laughs> All right, so com uh, uh, so combat. Fuck. So, anyways, day three. It's not combat. Fuck you. Wait, what? The, the grid is smaller now. Let me. Wow. The grid is bigger. Awesome. Happy Pog. Yeah. What? Uh, it's just, it's just happy pod. Everything is not snapping where I expected to. Wait, it's noon. <laughs> there was once a soldier who carried a money sword to the city down. It's a kind of cloudy day. A light drizzle, but nothing crazy. 
All right. Um, perception checks or survival checks. I'm gonna I'm gonna use help on uh on Zenvu. <laughs> help on Zenvu. Wait, why are you perceiving? Because uh, they. What do you perceive? Oh, oh yeah. I, I'm bound now. <laughs> so I'm gonna wake in the roller. <laughs> We're moving. We're moving now, right? True. Okay. Wouldn't, why wouldn't I? Oh. I gave you advantage, by the way, Zenvu. Okay. Yeah. All right. Here. Uh, eighteen. Not the nat one. Yeah, not the nat one. All right. So, uh, everyone place yourselves as you need to be. Um, you don't notice anything of note. Uh, the path that you are, you're going along the river path, right? Mm -hmm. And you see four kind of, uh, rocks. The statues, excuse me, as it were. Here, 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 and here. They kind of stare at the road. That might and, be my problem. You know, I just... uh, it seems as if they are guarding vigilantly over it. Wait, just be clear. These just statues, clear. excuse me. Wait, Kai, can you ping again? You said right here, 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 here. What the hell? Here. I can't see where a car is pinging. Do, I can't see where it's yeah, pinging. Yeah, I can't see the ping. Fuck. Here. There oh. we go. Can you see it? Here. Okay, here we go. Give me a second. Give me a second. Here and here. There you go. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Just four statues. What they is... seem to be uh, worn for wear, for sure. Are they any? Of, are they statues of particular gods? Um, they're statues of, well, demonic beings, like Baylor, so to speak. Oh, sweet Jesus! Uh, hey, Blood Hunter. Hmm. <laughs> I think this might be your expertise. He's got a book out and he's reading it, so he closes it and puts it in a pouch. I don't see my religion check. It actually would be amazing, but you never know. Nope. <laughs> Oof. Ironically, Clark doesn't have a great, wizard, a great religion check. Would this be a history investigation or what check? Well, what do you want to roll? What are you trying to find out? Uh, I would like to know why they're here, and why they're in okay. a group of four. Mm, history, sure. Ouch. <laughs> Can I give advantage? You can't really answer that one. Can I give advantage? Oh wait, sure. I have advantage because uh, grim psychometry. Oh, that's right. That's right. Wow, someone found a use for grim psychometry. Shocking, wow, right? That's not much better. <laughs> I've seen what. Actually, this will tell you. So, they were placed here a long, long time ago by some demons of sorts to kind of watch uh, this road for some unknown reason. Perhaps there's something wrong with this specific stretch of road. <laughs> Don't really know. You just know it was placed here by demons. Isn't it? Is there any well, abyssal? Were... Is there any abyssal script on there? Do you mean demons or devils? Demons. Uh, <laughs> let me look that up real quick. Oh my uh, god! Lawful evils, devils. Demons. Okay. demons. Oh. While we're at it, am I able to like push this over or something? Like give it a, <laughs> give it a good shove. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be an obelisk encounter if we do that. <laughs> Actually, it looks like there's a hill beneath it, so if you push it, it's going to fall all the way down there. I mean, are you going to push it? I mean, should I push it? Well, I, well I'm curious. Does it have any abyssal script on it? Because I can read abyssal. Uh, yes. Yeah, there's abyssal. All right, give me a second. I kind of walk over. What are we looking at? If you are suspicious of being seen by demons, by the way, I wouldn't stand near their eyes. He, he, he points at the hood. I have no idea what you're referring to. Cloak of Elven Kind. They can't see me even if they wanted to. Ah, I see. 
No, I don't. I guess. <laughs> basically, basically, it gives a little file. Ha ha! Good one. Uh, that's what we're looking at exactly. So uh, oh. you read Abyssal, right? Mm -hmm. If thou art free of toil and sin, oh, then no. pray right here and seek within. Yeah, toil okay. and sin. Then sit right here and then pray right here. Then pray right here and seek within. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, from what I can tell, they're placed by demons. Okay. How about the one where Jax is at? Yeah. Uh, that one says the same thing. I'm okay. I guess I'm gonna assume they all say the same thing. Um, uh, the two in the back that says, "If you wish to flee, you will not be free." Come, stay here forever with me. That huh. sounds fucking ominous. Yeah. I'm uh, not, I'm not too sure to about that. about praying to a statue made by demons that says to pray to it in Abyssal. No. Right next to the ones that say, you're not leaving, man. <laughs> ah. You're not leaving, man. <laughs> Do I want to test my luck? Definitely do not trust this. I do have adventurer's luck, so if I fail a check, I can re-roll. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Do I want to attempt this? It's not like I follow. No. It's not like I follow any god anyway. So, uh, uh, as your religious counselor, no. <laughs> <laughs> fine, <laughs> fine. <laughs> Come on, there's an achievement for the obelisk encounter. Go oh for my it, god! Guys. <laughs> I fucking called it! I fucking okay, called okay, it! Okay, okay, then, then, then we let Jack shove it. <laughs> Jack, you can shove it now. We're doing the encounter. <laughs> shove, shove it while Nathan's right under it. Shove the statue. You shove the statue. Roll a strength check. A strength check. Okay. <laughs> Anything once we're done fucking with it, uh, 18. he's gonna destroy it. 18? Yes. Alright, you shove the statue. It's pretty hard to move. I would say you are not successful in shoving it. Okay, I'm gonna take out my sword and I'm gonna slash at it. Oh my god. Alright, roll the hit. I kind of just walk, I kind of just walk back where Anya is and I'm just watching, where Anya and Ethan is, I'm just gonna watch this. <laughs> like, it's like, Here we go. I, I kind of look at the two of them and I say, "Place your bets." Bounces off. Fifteen. Uh, can you uh, give me five for bouncing? Let's see here. Fifteen to hit. Yes. Your weapon dinks off it and doesn't even get a little again off. Uh, uh, again, oh, roll. That doesn't work. Okay, again? again. 17. Okay. A 17, you do shove it a nice good bit in there. Okay. This is gonna burn. Your rolls are roll looking damage. like mine. <laughs> oh, I don't have to roll. What do you mean? This sword does max damage to objects. Ah, yeah, the okay. sword of sharpness. Oh, God. Yes. Uh, and clarify, can you tell me what this weapon is? Sword of sharpness. I literally told you like it's the a magical weapon, correct? Yes, it's a magical uh, weapon. Cool. Oh so, God. It also it also chops the limbs off people, from what I remember, right? Yeah, but you have to roll two nat twenties in a row. True. You know, <laughs> you know I'm actually gonna say I hate the fact that it's an extra fourteen damage. Yeah, it's actually fourteen slashing 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 damage. 23? Yes. And here we go. The sword go. gets in halfway, and then stone shuts underneath it. Your sword is lodged within the creature. Mm. Oh, did I say creature? creature? Yeah, that's right. Uh, the stone bailer awakens. There we go. Your sword is there lodged in it. Please roll initiative. I don't care. No blame for this. What about the other three? Cool. They all awaken. They and all they start awaken. chanting in uh in unison. Cool. Cool. Sinner. Sinner. 
I cast Holy Aura. <laughs> holy aura. This, this is going to be hilarious. What does that do? Wait, what? just be just be clear. What? Initiative is a dexterity oh. ability check, right? Uh, no, it's not. That's why, it, like, stuff no, like, uh... Not, yeah. Sorry. Stuff like Bard's uh, Jack of All Trades doesn't affect it. Oh! <laughs> the two and a half twenty. What? Hey, let's go! What the fuck? <laughs> you guys are fucking crazy. <laughs> are we surprised or no? Ah, uh, yes. Whenever um, I'm rolling to attack, I get a nat one. But hey, whenever I'm that. rolling initiative, also it is an it, also, it is a dexterity okay. check, by the way. So we're not surprised. Yeah, we're not surprised. Yeah. Okay. By the way, it is a dexterity check. I guess I should. It's actually set up. Oh my god, board. who are those little boys? So, there's one right next to Jack. I'm gonna give uh, I'm gonna give advantage to Oh yeah, on his on his ability <laughs> check. You want to add some combat music they wish to use? Oh on my uh And here I was about to flip off the well, eyes. Actually, actually I'm gonna give it to Seth. I'm gonna give it to uh Ger Ger Graza. Oh, god fuck it, let me see your name again. Uh -huh. There we go. Thank you. Graza uh -huh. on his on his initiative check because because initiative is a dexterity check. Uh, thank you, Sage Arcana. But also, Thanks, why? Sage Arcana. But also, but, but at the same, Sage Arcana. But at the same time, Mike. But at the same time, Jamie Crawford. Why the fuck didn't you say that to begin with? You should have oh, gave Belbier yeah. Jack that. <laughs> uh, I don't have a weapon anymore, so. Like you said, yeah. Jack Black. <laughs> also, Tim, you um, Tim, you get advantage on your uh, initiative roll, by the way. Cool. Do y'all want to choose your own music, or do you want me to try to surprise you or something? So, um, I got it. I need all the help with initiative I can get. Give me a second. So, okay. Uh, Yoldir and I both got nat 20s. <laughs> Plus five. Yeah, I assume you guys both have 20 decks. Yes. This is beautiful. Where am I in the initiative? Oh, I guess you're not in there. Yeah, I'm not in the initiative. <laughs> you don't deserve to go. You don't get to play. You awoken these guys, just go down. Car. Yeah? I'm not in the initiative. I'm adding you. <laughs> there you go. These... Oh my god, I just looked at Tim's rolls. Are these large sized creatures? Yes. Good to know. I just want to say this I went from a 2 to a 19 with that advantage. What do you say? Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I, Graza, great at a lot of things. Not the most dexy person in the world. Alright, Jax, you're first. Hey. Oh my god. Okay, pull out my javelin. Damn. You launch your javelin. With that zero I'm, not gonna ja I'm not gonna launch it, I'm just gonna Wait, stab. Nathan, you thought it was zero initiative? <laughs> You're gonna stab? I'm gonna stab with my javelin. Because I can use right. it as melee. Apparently. Oh, oh, my god. Uh, oh, wait, what the heck? There we go. Um, can you redo mine again? Because apparently it didn't save. Yeah. <laughs> what does Holy Aura do? I'm gonna read some stuff here real quick. Carl, oh. can you re can you re um shuffle the initiative again? But apparently I didn't save my twenty three. Ethan out here, zero initiative. Uh, and re put your initiative. What's your initiative? No, I put it in. I just didn't save. Never can you re shuffle it? Some... All right, it's reshuffled. Sorry. All right, cool. And you said creatures shed light. Oh wait, never mind. I can choose. Okay. So if it's, if it's dark, they bring their own light. Okay, so... <laughs> this is first like... one, second one, third one, wow. Basically, everything in there is being licked by magical flames. This is the way I'm playing it. It's more like holy, uh, holy flame. Hey, Carter, I got a 13 and a 16 and a natural one. 
All three of those miss. This is sad. Action surge. All right. Let's go again. 26, 22, nat 20. <laughs> All those hit. <laughs> <laughs> the nat 20 gets off. double damage. Yes. Opposite. Oh, and I also, I'm a brute, so I get my fighter level to my damage. Beautiful. Car, I'm going to be doing a lot of damage with this tiny little javelin. And what type of damage is it? Uh, piercing. Which it probably... No, yeah, not magical. It's probably not going to do anything, is it? No, go. Here. First one. Second one. Third one. Here, 11 plus 8 plus 9 plus 28 that plus 15. Um, let me look at my other crap here. Oh, yeah, and those all do another 2d6 because I'm brute. So, no, I mean, no, another 1d6 because I'm a brute. So, one, two, three. Wow. Wow. Oh, <laughs> shit. 11 plus 8 plus 9 plus 4 plus 1 plus 1 plus 15. Okay. So, uh, 98. So, you dig so many attacks into it. You hit it with your javelin. You try to pick the shit out of it. But it's it does like nothing. Hitting bedrock in Minecraft, it does nothing. Great. I can't do any damage. I'm gonna walk away. You're gonna walk away and take an attack of opportunity, I imagine? You know what? That's acceptable. Actually, you know what? No, I, no, that's not acceptable. I'm gonna... Um, see here. What do I got here? I wonder how much this thing weighs. Huh. Is that something I can just like determine, Car? Mm -hmm. Like how much I how much I could guesstimate it weighs? Yeah. Okay, so uh, how much can I guesstimate this thing weighs? A couple tons. Couple tons. Okay. So not anything I can lift. I can try to shove it though. <laughs> yes. But I can't do that because I did my things. So crap. Um. Okay. Yep. This is all I can do. Uh, having fun. So this yeah, is one of, So this is one of your. So what is this is one of those boss fights, isn't it, Car? Boss fights. If not literal boss fights. I mean, so this is one of those fights since you're using that picture. What? No. <laughs> Why? This what is isn't it? four mage being columns. No. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I guess uh, also quite remember they have uh, any enemy within my range has disadvantage on the attack. Okay. All right. So whose turn is it next? It's Yeldir. Whoa! Hooray! Yeldir is gonna take out a little mess of what looks like uh, several iron bands. Does a little toss with it in his hand before saying "Larfoon" and then tossing it at. This guy. Okay. Roll the yeah. It is to hit, yeah. Twenty-two. Twenty-two hits. He is restrained. Oh, movement speed zero. Yep. Nice. I'm gonna step here. Use giant smite to turn large size, and then I'm gonna try and grapple the one that I was in front of. I cannot upscale myself. Oh, you can. You want to be large? Yeah. Large boy. And then I'm gonna try and grapple the one to my left. And now you're flanked. It's fine. Yeah. Damn. Twenty nine to grapple him. He is grappled. Oh, did you already make the contest roll? 
Yep. Damn. 23. He's grappled. Hmm. I could action surge and try and grapple the other one right now. Sure, why not? Okay. Ouch. Don't you have advantage since since you're large? Oh no, it's the same size as you. Never mind. No, I do have advantage because I'm large. Giant might giants might gives advantage on strength checks. Hmm. Of which athletics is a strength check. Uh, for the second one, I got 18. Twice. No, that won't work. Sorry. It's okay. I have another attack. <laughs> okay. Eleven level spot fighter be like. What? 29 again. How many more attacks does he need? 29. Alright. Did I get him? Oh, you grappled him? Yeah. Yeah, I guess that works. Alright, I have removed three creatures' speed. <laughs> that is the end of my turn. Dex went. Nathan! Alright. Uh, cunning action hide with my with advantage. Okay. That's 11. That's okay. That's 12 plus. That's a total of. That's a 27 for stealth. 27. Mm hmm. Okay. You seem to feel like they are not paying attention to you. Alright. I'm just gonna. Slow. I'm just gonna. You. Okay. I'm just gonna slightly. I'm just gonna silently make my way over next to Jax. And then Nathan's going to, like, unsheath his katana with, like, one thumb, and there's just a crackling of lightning before he just rips it out of, whips it out and just starts, and just swings at the stone golem, I mean, at the stone balor. Okay. So first attacks with advantage. Okay, that's a... Really? Is that it? That's a 19 to hit. 19 to hit. Mm hmm. That will hit. Alright, that is. That is. That's. Wow, that's max for, that's max for slashing. That's. 17. That's 17 magical slashing, and then. Uh. Uh. 17 magical slashing, and 14. And 14 lightning. 17 and 14. And then he's going to attack again. Alright, that's a 22 to hit. The hitch? Alright. That is... That is 10 magical slashing okay. and 10 and 10 lightning. Perfect. And then one more time. Oh my god. I'm a, I'm 11 levels fighter, dude. That's a 17 to hit. 17? Mm-hmm. 17 will hit. Uh, that is 17 magical slashing and 6 lightning. Okay. And I would action surge, but nah, nah, I'm gonna save it. <laughs> oh my god. You get you dig your attacks and take out chunks of rock from this uh, petrified Baylor, so to speak. And then I ask an abyssal I'm gonna ask an abyssal, so what's the whole point of you guys standing here? Guys. Uh they don't respond as it is this thing's turn. Do I have to make any check to get unrestrained or am I just stuck? Uh DC twenty strength check. Alright. It's a strength, strength save specifically. What is this thing strength save? Whoa! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> remember back I have a feeling my magic item has gone to waste. <laughs> remember, remember remember back when strength remember back when strength checks and strength and strength um saving throws could be could both be harmed by hex? Pepper, Pepper, which oh, one yes. remembers? Uh, 
Pepper Charm remembers. Which fuck remembers? <laughs> no, not <laughs> yeah. What were you uh, gonna we'll say? You, uh, you have you disadvantage. You have no idea about how he's telling you. Oh, well. <sighs> hmm? Alright. Sorry. Uh, 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 anyone in my aura has advantage on saves, and creatures and enemies have disadvantage on attack. Hey. Sorry. Okay. okay. Uh, are these things fiendish? These? No. Okay. <laughs> we can't. Oh this boy, constructs. You guys keep making really big. <laughs> Who's <laughs> who is that? Who's <laughs> child is this? <laughs> Who's child is this? How do I get rid of YouTube? Or not YouTube. Fucking Yahoo. Is, is your search browser or? Yes, that's my search browser. How do you still have this issue? It just keeps <laughs> coming back. Oh my god, man. <laughs> you have something installed in Chrome that is causing it to constantly reset back to Yahoo at this point. I hate this. All right, and I guess I'll try to roll the die in what, what I currently have. Nope, it just goes back to fucking Yahoo. Uh, oh, fuck. What's so pissed? I, I can't roll die if it, it, it sends me to Yahoo. That's why I'm mad. Then use roll 20. No, but then you see that. Doesn't can't you do like a GM roll? Yeah, yeah, you, can do yeah, a GM yeah roll. you can do a GM roll. Yeah, if you, you go to... From so the there's... Players. Car, there, if you go to the top left, like where that little bar is... Go to the dice, and if you hit GM, it should only show it to you. Like I can, I can only send rules to you. Actually, actually, um, Carl, you can actually type that into the chat itself. Type what in the chat? You can GM roll from the chat. Slash GM roll one d twenty. Yep. Oh uh, yeah, to GM rolling. Yep. I'm assuming you guys did not see my GM roll. Nope, I didn't. Yeah. And you guys didn't yep. see mine either. <laughs> I know. Oh, shit. What? Sorry. Uh, nothing. Uh, well. Okay. Uh... 18? On the save? Nope. Still restrained. Hey, that has been an all too useful turn. That oh, also yeah. uses up its whole action. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. Alright, I'm gonna move... Oh, I forgot to give Ethan a fucking... Whoops. Just give him my initiative. It's okay. <laughs> Ethan's not participating. <laughs> now is the time of Fox Neal. The time is now. Uh, right. Can I roll, like, a survival, I guess? Or insight to see if they're, like... Uh, uh, if they can... They're vulnerable to like a certain attack or something. Sure. Alrighty. This one is an insider survival. Investigation. Oh. Or Investigation. nature. Nature. No. Nature. It's ass either way. Nature. Ugh, Eleven. Eleven. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, there isn't any obvious weaknesses to this, just a lot of strengths. Uh, it does seem to be weak to Yo there, though. He's doing a lot of restraining over here. He needs a restraining <laughs> order. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm gonna throw two javelins at the one all the way at the right. Oh, yeah, okay. all the way at the right. Uh, uh, javelin, baby. Are those magical javelins? No, I wish. We're not gonna do anything. I'm still here right now. You have advantage because it's restrained. Oh, I do. Okay. Mm -hmm. Unless you're talking about the one to the right of me. No, not that one. But the no, one I'm the doing the right. one all the way at the right. All right. <laughs> Not wait to use this music again. <coughs> okay, twenty-two. Uh, the 
does a 22 and a 21 hit. 22, 22 and a 21? Yeah. Yes. They Yay! Pog. 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 Um. Yeah. That's 20 damage all together. Piercing damage. I don't have Chrome downloaded. What? Huh? Go down. <laughs> How do you not have Chrome downloaded? I'm using Chrome right now! No. Yes. What? I oh. need to use the Chrome to download Chrome. <laughs> what? Also, I got disconnected <laughs> from Roll20. Hold on. <laughs> how, much, uh, how much damage Google was Chrome. that? 20. 20 oh, piercing. Wait. Oh, wait, sorry. <laughs> Yahoo! Is pissing me off. Um. Well, you do twenty damage, but the the javelins kind of just plink off the the the, the body. Ooh. Doesn't feel like you've done much of anything on that damage. It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough. All right, next up is what another golem? Yep. Yep. Yeah. And it has disadvantage on its attacks. Mm hmm. Mm, I see. Oh, but I guess my, I guess the defender thing's not gonna, well, I guess the shield thing's not gonna matter. Yeah, we have shield thing. So. <laughs> All that it's gonna do on its turn is it's gonna take its arm and slowly bend and snap Jax's uh, uh, sword. Oh. Great. Now I don't have any magic weapons. Thanks, Car. <laughs> oh, can I mending it? <laughs> yeah. Wait, you can mending. You can just use mending, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, you can mending sure. magic items and they keep their properties. Okay. Do they? Yeah. Yeah. Right. That's why. That's why I have the iron bands. If it's you could have fixed magic right now, items, bro. I would have gotten the uh, okay. Okay. dimensional shackles. Gotcha. <laughs> I'm not here to make your life fucking miserable. <laughs> Just only the combat. Arion <laughs> has mending too. Arion! Hi! It's your turn. How's it going, guys? Um, How's it going, bros? Let's come on over to your actual combat, yeah, should I? <laughs> oh, God. Hey guys, what's up? Um, <laughs> so first of all, where 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 are these things? Can I? I'm just gonna right there. Yeah. Can I uh, summon my wildfire spear right here? Uh, sure. Spooky. Yeah. Spooky spirit boy. Spooky spooky spirit boy. I don't think. Um, and yeah, let's see, you, your spell attack bonus to hit, spell attack bonus to hit is my mod plus my proficiency, right? Yep. Yes. Uh-oh. Okay. Yeah, so oh, wait, before I do that, um, can I... So good. Deck hey, save unfit. from this uh, the, the the golem right next to him. Of course. And does a twenty one hit? Oh god, we we actually does a twenty one hit. Does a twenty one hit? <laughs> yes. Please I'm just don't making do fourteen sure. damage. I don't think I'm gonna do fourteen damage. My spirit is very weak. Honestly. Oh no, <laughs> only seven fire damage. And did it succeed its deck save or no? 
Oh. No, he would like to have just like. GM rolling. Okay, always, so always great if you want to put the fear of God in your players. What? GM rolling, so that they can never see how much they hit for, how much you hit for. <laughs> <laughs> don't like this command. You can't keep track of your own health. Uh, I mean, no, it's a twelve. Is it twelve? Yes. Oh, hi. That's six more damage. Thirteen total de fire damage. Oh no! Oh, I, damage. I didn't take. I didn't deal fourteen damage like you asked me to. Thirteen, nearly. Oh, um, <laughs> nearly. I, I Alright, anything else? I'm gonna be upset at the uh, no, we're chilling. Wait, we're chilling? wait a minute, were you making a reference to wait. Empire again? <laughs> Actually, i like to move him back just a few tiles. Yeah, Ooh. come back over here, buddy. Wait, how high was all of this initiative? Holy shit, wait. Yeah, we're just now <laughs> getting out of the 20s. Yeah, we're, yeah. <laughs> we're still in the 20s. Yeah, we're just now about to get out. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, uh... Welcome to high level gameplay. Where'd Ethan go? He's a twenty. He's he's got the same Ethan's initiative as me. Taking part. No, he's oh, got the same initiative as you. He's gonna cry. <laughs> so we have three people with an initiative under twenty. He practices fighting. That doesn't mean that he actually wants to fight. He's my brother. He's he's learning. He's learning. He's learning. Grazifer. Uh, cool. I will cast Harm on World. Okay. Harm um, what? Harm? Uh, this one. Okay. I needed to make a constitution hey, save. Hey, you know what? Uh, at least, no, at least you're good then. Uh, Jackson? At least you're good then. Can I please uh, not get you uh, two? Or not you two? Flipping. Just use roll 20! I don't want to. Oh my god. GM roll. Ian, look away. Ian, look away. I swear. Uh, that one. Look away. Uh, cool. You take fourteen d six damage. <laughs> Jesus oh, Christ! Oh mean? my God! <laughs> oh shit! I did that one. Ah <laughs> oh, yes. Ah <laughs> oh, yes. Only one d six is fourteen. Ah. <laughs> 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 is that double? Uh, it's double, yeah. isn't that failed? I think Ooh. so. Oh. Oh, that's. That's. That's 98. <laughs> what did, did you, you cast? Casually just take. Uh, arm? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, harm! Oh, it certainly did that. Like. War Clinic. You know what? Fuck this harm! <laughs> no, <for laughs> <someone>. <laughs> yes. The opposite of heal. Yeah, I also have heal. Heal good. For a class that's typically considered a support, it has a lot of damaging spells. Yeah. Oh no. You want to see? see the, you want to see, see the, how much it destroyed that bar, guys? You want to see? You want to see? You want to see what happens when a cleric becomes a total, absolute unit that just obliterates stuff? Look at a light or tempest cleric. Those guys do not fuck around. <laughs> yeah. No. No, they do not. <laughs> yeah. Doesn't tempest do max damage? With lightning with damage. Divinity. Yeah, with lightning yeah. damage. I'm like, lightning Jesus. And thunder. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm like, Jesus. I'm just a forge player. I'm a melee player. We're not like bullying them. Skedaddle, skedaddy. Your hands are now. Uh, Wait, I used the wrong rhyme. No, Skedaddle, skedaddy. Your hands are now May. <laughs> All right, Gollum turn. Uh, it's supposed to say it's grapple, they can still attack, right? Huh? Yeah, while well, grappled, it can still attack. Cool, hey, come on, attack. Actually, no, wait, uh, I will move a little bit. Sorry. Bruh. Hmm. Just to get that sweet disadvantage. Right. Yep. Bruh. Why are you gay? <laughs> I think that's a question we should be asking you. Hit me, coward. I am, I, am not, I am fighting you, coward. Yeah. Does a 28 hit? Yes. Yes, that is with disadvantage. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I get. It. Are they? And uh, hmm, you're not gonna like this. I rolled two nat twenties on the other one. We saw the second one. What? We saw the second nat twenty. Oh. Uh, 
Bruh. <laughs> well, um. We'll take it like a champ. Take it like a champ, brother. What damage is that? Do they? But do they petrify? Is the question. Uh, do they petrify? Okay, wait. Maybe are you rolling? Petrify. Are you rolling for both of them separately? Yeah. Like at this moment? Can you I do the one? Them. Can you do the one that's a uh, higher initiative first, then? Hmm? I hope you uh, have to. Okay, yeah, the first one then. So I hope that's a yes. Um, it's going. Just tell me whatever you... damage that does. Uh, Why yes. do I get the feeling I know what's about to happen? What? Nothing. Nothing. You may. Uh, Remember you. Uh, had... twenty-eight bludgeoning damage. All right, vengeful assault time. Oh, here we you go. Have, uh, if it matters at all, advantage on your saving throws. Okay. Twenty-nine to hit. Yes. Oh, uh, no, but I'm not in hybrid form, so it doesn't matter. Bruh. I still do 1d8, but my attacks aren't magical. 8 damage. Nice. Pog champ. It is slashing, not bludgeoning. Is it magical? No. Alright, I'm gonna just add that 8 damage back on. <clears throat> Shame. <laughs> Oh, right. Yeah. I need to lower my health by 27, right? You get the, uh... Yes, 27. You get the Cat of Despair. But I handled it like a champ, crying Spider-Man. <laughs> crying Spider-Man. <laughs> I was gonna go into hybrid transformation, too, on the next turn. Ow, fuck. And then... <laughs> Suck. Even worse, if I were in hybrid transformation first, then I would have resistance to this shit. To magical oh, well. or non-magical? Uh, it's got to be non-magical. Mm. I don't think they. Uh, I think very few creatures have magical attacks, though. Thankfully, though, it's always funny. And forty-two magical bludgeoning. Never mind. <laughs> You know what? I think they're doing magic damage. <laughs> you know what? Oh! <laughs> you know you know did golems. You think? Tim. No, they're not golems. I'm sorry. Well, if they're, if they're fiends, they take a... They get blinded. <laughs> they're not fiends. Yeah. They're contra. Uh, da, da, da. Ah, oh, am I finally doing damage to someone? Finally, I'm happy. But it's not on you. And it's, it's okay, not on you, sad. <laughs> sad pug. It's okay, oh. I'm doing my job. Fox Neil is going to run up and start blasting. Hey, the gun spears are so back. Start blasting. So anyway, <laughs> the spears are back in town. Spears are back in town. Oh my god! Yeah. yeah, he got some damage on him. Did he get more gun spears, or is this the same amount? Yeah, he's got six now. Finally. Finally. How much Tokyo Skull did I have to scrounge out for him to get that? Well, that's a good portion. Yeah. Hey, well, what the hell was that playing card? What? What playing? Oh, you could play cards now. I forget about that. Yeah, no, that's always been a thing, but I saw it and I was like, wait, did someone just use a playing card? Just back at the top of the round. Oof. Look at this dude being wait. barely in range. Wait, actually, even if it's broken, doesn't the Sword of Sharpness still do slashing damage? Hmm? That's an interesting question. If this, if How much it, did they break? It would be counted as an improvised weapon in terms of damage, but it would just, it would still use the, the sword's properties. Would it still have the magical effect? Yeah, it'd still have the magical effect. I wouldn't think it'd break it. But it would right. just do improvised weapon damage instead. Good night, Tide. Tide. But it's still Good kind night, of like, Tide. but it's it a magic Tide. I don't drink what you watched. What? Does it count as magical damage, though? Yeah. It's better than okay. nothing. Yeah. 
Okay. Muffin much, kiddo. So, hold on. Give me that. Okay, hold on. Let me look at my crap real quick. Give me results. Which still counts as a two handed weapon. <laughs> a two handed weapon? Yes. Um. No. Okay. Just checking. Okay, so. One, two, three, seven, twenty-one, and fifteen. Seven, twenty-one, and fifteen? Yes. Bruh. Only the twenty-one hits. Okay. Don't roll the one. Yes. Seven. It's not a one. <laughs> you seven damage, car. Wait, the watch. Hooray! Thank you, Night Tide. I mean, Night Tide. Fuck! Thank you, Senju. <laughs> Thanks, Night Tide. <laughs> Thanks, Night. Thanks, Night View. Night View. Dude, well, Han, these things don't count as mat. I uh, don't count as objects anymore, right? Not anymore. Okay, just checking. Get him. Uh, and that'd be it. Yeah. <laughs> So Yell a deer. All Yell right. at a deer. I want to hold. Uh, when you have a creature grappled, you can move them, right? <laughs> okay. I want to move this one in front of me to right there. Okay. Ooh. And then I'm going to. A like blue light starts to well up inside Yeldir's chest. And then he shoots out lightning from his mouth, angled. From there to there. Okay. So he's hitting both of them. Nice. That's a deck save from the one grappled and the one restrained, nice. but only the one restrained has disadvantage. Uh. Huh. You would have thought that he would have automatically failed. Hmm. Disappointing. Sorry, my internet died. Please hold. <sighs> oh my god. At zero speed, you would also fail a deck save. Yes. You know what? Got it. Yeah. Oh my god, I guess, what is that? I guess I guess it would make it too similar to stunned, which Yeah. Earth weapon forty six. Yep. Haha, -ha, I fixed it. Also, haha, -ha, I rolled the net one of the deck save. Oh god. I'm so glad I'm using Google again. For which one? Uh oh yeah, there are two. Uh one on the deck save and the machine uh, one has a seen on the other one. Which one got that one? <laughs> the one next to you. Ah, that's odd. Oh well. Uh, the DC was 18. So fail. One, uh, the one that didn't nat one takes 13. The one that did nat one takes 26. 26 what? Lightning damage. <laughs> also, I didn't say it. I have unarmed fighting, so both of the creatures that are grappled took an automatic 1d4, but I don't think it really changed anything. Well, if you transform, maybe. 23, you said? Right. Uh, 26 for the lightning damage. Oh, I see. Yo, yo. <laughs> did, did cool At the start of my turn, though, since they're both grappled, they both took an automatic 1d4, okay. but again, non-magical. Did Cooler Freddy break again? Probably. What happened? Cooler Freddy, I think, broke. Oh. Oh, no, there he goes. Oh, the song just hey ended. Uh, for my bonus hey action, I'll use hybrid transformation. Cool, man. That's the end of my turn. Ethan's gonna get up here. Am I using his reactional rock? Oh, do you wanna and move? his action to it rock, I think. I'm pretty sure you Nope. Action movement. Oh, yeah, Excuse me. Uh 
guy's going to run his hand across his katana and a uh, black flame will appear and he will go and take some slashes at that. Lightning and flat fire. Nice. Stop. Good. Uh, is, tell us when. He... Let's see here. Wait, I have to get the link. Again. To... Oh my god! Twenty-nine damage. Okay. Kills it. It has one elf. <sighs> He's got one more attack, doesn't he? Yeah. True. How aggressive. Uh, can you? I think uh, Yaldir wanted to move this one in front of him. Yeah, I did. Oh. Yeah, he moved it. Oh, you he... moved it there. I see. Yeah, that's how I did the breath weapon. Lightly. You see, I got golems for hand now. <laughs> I'll, be, I'll, be, I'll, I'll beat you. I'll beat this guy with another guy. I'll beat your golem with my golem. And uh, he takes an overhand swipe and this huge, like, uh... I guess this huge swipe of just black and white flames cuts the uh, golem in half. Guys, look at the golem. It rumbles into a nice uh, fine yeah, dust. Okay. Look at the golem. Look at him. I'm glad we have the same idea for our swords. Of course. How attractive. We're, we're going too fast. But Seems yeah. Father has taught us well. All right, now it's uh, which golem's turn? This golem. Hey, the restraint. Well, one. he's gonna make another strength save. DC twenty. Wait, no, he's not actually. Excuse me. But that golem's demise, the threat of prophecy, is now severed. He's restored. Um, character saved or persistent in the doom world you have created. What does that mean? It uh, it it lets out a command, and it says, summon. We're learning that he salmon. What does it summon? What does it summon? Oh. <laughs> and you hear some four poofs of, like one out of black four. smoke up here behind you. No. Wonderful. Yeah. And some kobold screeching, I guess. Yeah. Really? <laughs> it's not kobolds, dude. <laughs> when is okay, it? Hold on, kobolds? guys. Oh, <laughs> I only have two hands. <laughs> I will crush Gross you. With these, I will crush you with these golems. <laughs> I will beat you with my golem hand. <laughs> can, I, can I hold an enemy in my mouth? Stop. <laughs> All right. Uh, now you want to cross the line, buddy? I am large size. <laughs> I am large. As boop. There we go. Oh, hey there. Oh, they're tiny. Little baby men. Hi, yes. Oh, it's... Look at this, uh, look at this little pretty baby I'm gonna put in here for you. Are those imps? They look like imps. Oh, oh no. Maybe. Look at the image you just sent. Is that what an imp looks like? No, that's not oh, an imp. What does look like? I can't remember um, what that yeah, is. No. That is? No, it's not. I can't remember what it is, though. Also, just because I also just because we keep saying this joke, I just gotta post this here now. Beat a motherfucker with another motherfucker. My favorite weapon. <laughs> the motherfucker. All right, Nathaniel. Okay. Or Nathan. Okay. Who wants to deal with who? Um. God, I could just hold up. How far back is that? Okay, yeah, I can do that. Okay. Um, how weak do those guys over there look? The left. Weak? How weak do they look? They're weaker than the golems, but they're still very formidable. No, I didn't. Um, I'm going to look between them and say, okay, you guys want to handle what, deal with the rest of the golems? Damn it. I can work with the golems. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's right. I, 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 think, wait, I think everyone here has damage that doesn't, that is not, that is magical for the most part. 
Well, yeah, well, mine's half inside a golem. <laughs> I hand you broken by the I way. hand Jax my long sword to use for the rest of the fight until we can oh, fix his yay, sword. Oh, long sword. Yeah, he's, I got a plus long one. Sword. I got a plus one. I hand him, I hand him, I hand him, the, I hand him the plus one long sword that Graza would definitely be pissed off if it broke. Okay, long wait. Sword. So you said that Jax's sword, it still does magical damage, but it's an improvised weapon, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I have Tavern Brawler. I would roll the same I would with a regular weapon. Except, also, the sword is tiny for me now, because I didn't have it when I grew. Yep. Yeah, Five, true. It'd be like 10, training you to come 15, back to beat someone. 20, Toothpick. 25, 30, 35. Okay, gonna move here, and then you see Nathaniel kind of like sheet the sword again. He's gonna take a deep breath. And then with a crackle of lightning, he's gonna move. He's gonna move like a lightning bolt across across in a line, and he's gonna he's gonna use blink step on both on both of, on both of these guys. Oh. So fast. So I get to roll an attack. I get to roll three attack rolls each on them. Um, okay, first one is a fourteen to hit. 14 to hit. That hit? Yes. Wait. 14. No. Okay, I was about to say. I was about to say, 19. Yes. Not 20. Clearly. Okay, so for the first guy, so for the first guy, he takes, he takes, uh, I mean, I'm just gonna roll this. Down. Okay, he takes 15 slashing, 13 lightning. For the first, for the first one, right? Let's just total this all up together. Hold up. Fifteen slashing, thirteen lightning. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's the first guy. No, or that's this the guy or this guy. Uh, this guy and that. This. Oh wait, no, it's not hitting. Uh, this is the. That's the first damage roll. I'm, you know, I'm just gonna total them all together. Okay. Uh. Oh eight, wow. <laughs> eight, eight, nine, nine plus nine. That's eighteen times two. That's thirty-six damage. 36 damage on that guy in total? Yep, that's 36 damage on the second one, yeah. So then, I'm just gonna roll. It's time for the second guy to get hit. That's a 15 to hit. Okay. 15 hit? Mm, yes. I'm gonna assume that a, that a 14 doesn't hit. A 14 does not. And that's a 24. Yes. Uh, so the 15 and the 24 hit. All right, so that's... Okay, so I'm just going to add these all together. So okay. that's... So that's... Okay, so that's 14, that's 10. 14 and 10. 14 and 10. 14 and 10. 14 and 10. Uh, two more. Okay. So that's a total of that's twenty. That's twenty-four magical slashing, and that's twenty-one lightning. Twenty-four magical slashing. Nineteen lightning. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I needed to do math. Math is hard. Okay. All right, there we go. Sorry. Okay. And the last but not least, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use the my mastermind feature to give Anya to give Anya advantage advantage on. Yeah, advantage advantage if she had. I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna use a bonus I'm gonna use the help action as a bonus action on Anya. To give her advantage okay. on her next attack roll. Advantage on the attack roll, Anya. Wait a second. That's how help works. Uh, it's that, uh, and you can give, you can get. Uh, to be exact, it's help. Here we go. You can I lend it. You can lend aid to another creature in form of a task, giving them advantage on a next ability check it needs to perform before the start of your next turn. Or you can, or you can alternatively, you can. Aid a friendly target and an attacking a creature within five feet of you, but for Mastermind it makes it thirty. Um, you faint, distract the target, oh, or in sure. some other way team up to make your 
allies attack more effective. If your ally attacks the target before your next turn, the first tackle is made with advantage. That's pretty awesome. Yep. Mastermind. So wait, what did you give me? Uh, you have advantage on your next attack roll. Oh, boo. I was going to do Rex's attack, but thank you. No problem. Thank. Thank you. Speaking of advantage in the next attack roll, Anya, you're up. Okay, so... Bonus action, I'm going to rage... And as a full as action, I'm gonna uh, whisper into my ring that I got my fancy ring, and I'm gonna do uh, radiant damage. So since that takes up a whole action, I'm gonna do action surge. Action okay. surge and go. Probably over here. Okay. And I'm gonna hit that dude with my bastard sword. Bastard sword. Bastard sword. Yes. Wait, is that all that I want to do? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I don't... Is your bastard sword magical? More music. Yeah. Okay, wait a second. It's got to loop back around. Oh. Yes. There it goes. I see. Hold on, I'm sorry. It's been a while since I used on your sheet. <laughs> I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's been a while. It's only been two weeks. Two weeks? No, it's been longer than two weeks. It's been, uh, so it's been a month. It's been a month and yeah. a half. Month and a half. Okay, oh, alright. That, that's the one I did actually have to die. Thank you. So, 15 and... So, 15 and 23. The last 15 and 23, both hit. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wait, no, 15 doesn't hit. Sorry. Oh. 23. Damn. Doesn't. All right. <laughs> Sad. Sad to hit you with that. Sad pog. Sad pog. Pog. Pog with the sad. Butter pog. Pog with the butter. Like Jackson. What do you Okay. Well, uh, 20 damage again. 20 damage? Yes, radiant. Magical radiant. Or That's mad damage. Yeah. I'm guessing. How much damage? One more time. 20 magical Wait. radiant. Or whatever that is. I just realized something. She gets advantage, by the way. She's flanking it. Oh, shit. Oh, that is true. Oh, I do? Oh, okay. Oh, you got advantage on it, anyways. Also, I'm double advantage. <laughs> no double advantage, but uh, yeah. Double advantage. We roll the fifteen to see if oh. you hit. <laughs> Not twenty. Oh shit! All right then. <laughs> Clearly that a roll damage. Okay, wait. I gotta add some stuff. <laughs> Bruh. Okay. All right. Oh my god! Uh, I've been forgetting my sneak attack this entire time. Damn it! <laughs> Who are you? Uh, yeah. Ugh. Y'all, y'all going easy on me, SMH. So that's just double damage, right? Oh, double. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep, times it by two. Jesus. Ian, we're that doing hurt. Ian. And then I. This is gonna I... hurt. Uh, uh... Mm. Guys, we're doing. How 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 do you have this? Oh. 24 times 2, it's 48, 48 damage. 48 damage. How do you want to do this? Um... I'll, I'll, like, grip my bastard sword tight, um, 
after doing a little bit of damage the last time and like do like a powerful swing and try to like slice its head off okay and you slice the head of this baylor like statue and it crumples into a fine dust yeah i want to use a blood curse okay oh wait a second it's dust yeah he has dust damn oh, i can't use it. it's, it's made of uh, stone pop on pop it, 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 there's probably a reason why my sword broke <laughs> <laughs> he won't let that go. <laughs> the entire body is dust, or the head? Entire body, bro. Okay, yeah, never mind. I can't use it then. Sorry. Imagine using a blood curse on something with no blood. <laughs> we are on. It's fine. Uh, I should have used it against the uh, one that died first, but I forgot about it. True. Oh, Anya, yeah, is that your turn? Um, yes. All right, Graz, it's your turn. You want to move back over to me? <laughs> Congratulations. What did you say? Bossy with cream, that is spinach dip. Key, what did you say? No, nah, no, nah, I was I was making a joke about Graz. Like, hey, you want to move over here to give disadvantage to these guys? Because I think they're about to fucking pile on top of me. Oh, okay. And you are Fox, Neil, and I don't think, uh... I mean, I'll be fine. The fuck is probably gonna get fucked. Also, yeah, there's wow. gonna... What? Oh. Such faith in Fox now. You know what? I believe. In I mean, Fox he's now. a glass cannon. Yeah. I'm gonna be real. I played him. <laughs> I know how he's built. <laughs> I played him. All right. Arion's just Ooh, built chance. normal. <laughs> Everyone else is just built different. Come on, guys. <laughs> Everyone's built different except Arion. <laughs> My sword's built different now. <laughs> I built if I'm built normal, then my fire spirit isn't built at all. <laughs> my sword just got built backwards. <laughs> Oops. Uh, let's see. Hi. Yeah, my fire spirit has 75 health. Well done, Anya. I can't wait. Thanks. To go beat the crap out of the defenseless column down there. Good job, and he, I wonder, he's probably come with a nickname for and Lupin, probably. <laughs> that column oh, has been yeah. stuck restrained since the start of combat. <laughs> Oof. Okay. Doomed forever to purgatory. Damn. He's getting taken on more. I'll, I'll say. Test. God, that would be okay. I say he's cash. I DM. I actually, I DM. So, uh, whose uh, turn is it? Sometimes I DM. Graza. Yeah. Graza. Is he doing something? Oh. Yeah, sorry. Talk to me a little bit. Let's wait for someone to say something. Maybe. Okay. Um... I will. He, he did it. That's all I will. Um. Say. One or. Uh, I'll do a three. Flag, no. Back. Uh, let's do a. Let's always... La uh, yeah, let's um, do a. Oh. Plus. I feel like. Um. S. Marta? Scale of the one, two. Yeah. Um. Anya? Yeah. Jax, the Elder, and. Oh, yeah. Anna, uh, each time you attack, and add a d4 to your attack. A okay. d4 to attack? Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah. To the attack uh, roll, specifically? Yeah. <laughs> you, you've been blessed. Okay. 
I have been blessed. Yeah. How athletic? Then I will. He. I actually spoke move, move this way. Is that okay? So I'd say. Alright, yeah, that's my turn. No one wants to touch Calamvir. <laughs> I think he's got it. Uh, did you do anything damaging? I'm sorry, Graz. Uh, no, I cast less. I mm. I I I, uh, it, when I did it, it starts Anya, Aaron, Yelta, and Jax add a d4 to your attacks. Oh, hi. Okay. Yeah. Well, um. As for now, I'm just gonna. Uh, uh, how far? Right, I'm gonna move forward a bit. Hey, guys, what's up? Um, and I'm gonna cast Firestorm, sending out a spark that, one, upon reaching its target, just ex uh, explodes into a storm of fire. And if I can. Yeah, and it's around this area ish. And it. Uh, both of them have to make a deck save. Both what kind of spell is save? built like that? <laughs> <laughs> well, fire, firestorm is consisted of 10 10 oh wait it's 10 10 foot cubes whoops that's a lot of cubes oh god jesus <laughs> I, I think some of them some of them can't overlap though i yeah. believe thank god but, um, thank god they let you overlap <laughs> otherwise what i'd be saying wonky fucking spell but uh each of them need to make <laughs> a uh uh, it's here, just here, like ten, ten foot cubes, like <laughs> like that, ten, or wait, yeah, it's ten, like ten foot cubes. Jeez. It's double ten, the squares you're putting there. Yeah, ten, ten, uh, like it's like oh, it, it's like this, right? So basically, we just yeah. see that entire row just light into flames. <laughs> <laughs> um, and you know, I'm gonna need them to make some deck saves. Is this a Tasha spell? It sounds like so one. So one and nope, six. Nope, it's handbook. <laughs> it's it's, it's <laughs> nat one and a six. A nat one and a six. Okay. The one that's being held by Yellowbeard had a nat one. Seventy ten. Oh, 7, 10. 10. There, there oh was, god. There is seven one ten disadvantage. Seven to ten, and then I can add one more d eight because of my enhanced bond. Nice. The fire spell. Wait, what? what? I'm a uh, circle of the wildfire druid. Oh, right, right, you're the druid. Yeah. God, I really hope he updates this character sheet soon. Uh, to add that. 32 damage, because I can treat ones as twos for damage. Okay, 32. Uh, ah, the great weapon fight, the great weapon fighting of, of, of druids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got a one or a two? Fuck that. <laughs> well, I had to get a few for it. And the other guy gets 64? Yeah. Jesus Christ. I have to do oh. math, hold on. Oh, elemental adept. Yeah. No oh, nice. I actually for a game for Shaofei's game, I had to build a dru I had to build a mystic that was based around fire and holy fucking shit. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah I'm basically uh basically a fire boy right now. Mystic nasty. And um Mystic Grody. You know, while I'm at it. Uh I'm gonna take a I'm gonna, for my bonus section, you know, hi yell dear. <laughs> I'm going to take a wild guess and say I'm about to be hit in the chest. Okay, what feature is that? This is your new friend. Oh. You, you might name? recognize him. <laughs> um, uh, yes, healing spirit. What is that? <laughs> Wait, what? Hold on. Hold on. Okay, where does that come Barry from? Bury the healing spirit. Can I attack the healing spirit? No. Um, I do not believe you can. Me, though. Yeah. I'd like to... Oh, that's... Wait, uh, for sure. And I'd like to use it with a third level spell slot. And yeah, I don't believe Yeldir gets the healing until it's his turn. So, uh, okay. yeah. Wait, that'll be the end of my that? turn. Well, since I can't attack Barry the Healing Spirit, I'll just punch Yeldir twice. My AC is 19 now. 22 and 28. Damn. <laughs> Oh, All right, let's both hit. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. This will likely put me into bloodlust. Yes, you're right. It's okay. No one's near you. That's 46 magical piercing. Or piercing, bludgeoning. I, Excuse me. 46 or 4D? 40. 40. Okay. 4-0. That's the total? Four zero plus six. Yes, it's the total damage. Wait, it got six on one of its attacks. That's pitiful. Weakling. All right. Weakling. 
Perfect. And before it kicks my ass. Whatever blood is leaking out of Yeldir is now steaming. Oh shit. Here we go. Bruh, Solaris coming in. Guys, 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 guys. Guys. <laughs> I don't want to say this right now, but... Uh... <laughs> Alright, Yeldir? Oh, is that it? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Fox still's going to just... <laughs> it's a description, it's not an action or anything. Oh, wait, I completely forgot. Go back behind these two... <laughs> Saxon. Uh, uh... Shoot away. I'm really sorry, but I forgot about this. Uh, those two guys that died, um, there's just some fire where they where they were now. Some fire. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Thirty-eight damage on the thing. And anyone walking through them will either get healed or damaged, uh, depending on what I want. Oh, or who it is. Oh, interesting. Yep, I'm about to get. Well, what did you guys? I don't. I don't want to play hike because uh, because Jackson. No, oh, I just realized I forgot to describe what his hybrid looks like. I'll do it next time. It's is it a oh, dragon? Is it a dragon wolf? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Oh, okay, Carl, cool question. Yes? Oh, this guy's all about attack me. No. Oh, okay. Okay. 15... Oh, this should be fun. Alright, they're going over to... Yes, this one's gonna go here. Oh wait, even without the healing spirit, I'd actually get out of bloodlust by the start so of my turn. Going to Anya. Hit me! Here to Arion. And I think that's enough for everyone but Yeldir. Uh, they're releasing these, like, uh, this, this kind of nauseous, toxic gas. I need everyone to make a constitution saving throw. Not a constitution saving throw. Can I at least be resistant to poison? Oh, no, wait, one. wait, no, as, oh. a, as a dwarf, you are. I thought as a hill dwarf. Oh, okay. oh, you are, yeah, fuck, yeah. Everyone in my war has advantage on yeah, and no, I... oh, you get advantage, Aleph. Hey, Thank God. <laughs> fuck! <laughs> Come on, man. Thank Ooh, God. Wait, there's there's an question. Um, you do get advantage. Hey, no, 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 no. What is going on? Anya, get the boyo. What the fuck is that? The boyo I'm holding. His right arm and right foot are in. Okay, <laughs> that's a reaction. It doesn't affect them. Quick question, uh, so, Car. Quick I'll question. Mm -hmm. Does an eleven? Okay. Does an eleven succeed? I just want to know this before I, I just want to know before I proc this. No. Adventurer's luck, I'm re-rolling. Okay. <laughs> adventurer's luck. Oh, it's a loop. <laughs> oh, it's it's a loop. It's the Guardian Lupin's ability. After they fail an ability check, attack roll, or saving throw, they get to re-roll that check once per they get to re-roll that once per long rest. Thirty. Alright, let's see. Thirty? Yes. Hey. Okay. <laughs> 29, baby. Hey. Okay. Congrats, oh, you right. now take half damage. When on your case, or in, or, in, or in on your case, she takes one fourth Probably if it's poison. It <laughs> yeah, there's this no. <laughs> you all are fine in this hazy mist, although it does become oh. kind of hard to see. Okay. Um. Let's see. Yeah. Cool. Going to you the talons they're going to just scratch at arion a bunch ah uh, that's not fun they not they will though that's unfortunate well, that's a nat 20 and a 19 
on the die rolls. <laughs> and they don't get disadvantage. True. Uh. Huh. So I am looking at something. Hey, Arn, you're still Ancestral Guardian, right? Yeah. All right, just curious. They, they screech annoyingly, Sinner! as they uh, scratch you with their claws and do uh... Oh wait, that's one attack. Sorry, I need to attack you two more times. Uh, so that is... That's uh, 30 damage, uh, slashing damage on the first go. And the second one's going to attack Nat 1 and uh, Nat 2, so... No. <laughs> just, the, just the 40 damage. Just the 40 damage? Only 40. Nothing to worry about. I'm no. alive, boys. Mostly. Excuse me, 40. Yeah, yeah, 40. Is it 40 for everybody? No, just, just Arion. Uh -oh. One for Anya. It's gonna do its little scratches at Anya. With disadvantage, unfortunately. Do it. And she gets... That's gonna miss. <laughs> and... Uh, nine's gonna miss, yeah. I'm sorry, this one wants to go here. And scratch at Nathan. Um, uh, hold up, hold up. Yay. Hold up, what? hold up. Um, <laughs> I'm going to use the... The just, what was it? The shield fighting the sh no wait not the shield no the defender fighting style which means my AC goes up to a twenty five. <laughs> you know, guys, uh, looking at my spell list, I'm starting to find out how many concentration spells the druids have. I know. Uh, right? I don't think uh, twenty four hits. River when you play a paladin. A what? I don't think a twenty four uh, hits then. Nope. Also, uh, also. Ranger, Ranger, I don't know why, but why do the, why do the, um... Half-casters? Half-casters and the Druid get so many concentration spells. I think right now, on my spell list, I have... Uh... Three? Four. Four spells, and three of them are cantrips that are attack spells that are not concentration. Really? <laughs> wait, Guiding yeah. Bolt. Oh, no, wait, no, that's Cleric guiding shit. Bolt. Cl guiding no. Bolt's Cleric, never mind. Shit. Yeah. God, ugh, that's disgusting. Uh, so, I'm... Yeah. Well, yo dear, what you got for us? Alright. Wait a second, it should be Jax's turn first. Oh yeah, that's right, yeah. He, he, it, st it still has you first in initiative order. Yeah. Wait. Jax, you are first. Sven Boo. Sven... Zenbu. Okay. Zenzu. Oh, I'm so, so Zenpai. Um, what the hell, hey. what the hell is this? Bye. What's Bye. going on here? That heals you, I guess. What? <laughs> oh yeah, the fire that heals you. Oh yeah, if I you guess. walk. Oh yeah, it's Arion's fire. If you walk through it, he can choose to either have a damage or heal you. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Um. <sighs> I'm gonna walk on up over here. Okay. Having a crisis over. So you walk in. Yes. Uh, I'm gonna start hitting this thing with this newly acquired longsword. Okay. Longsword. Longsword. Okay. One. You That's have an that one. Oh, I do. Okay. It's Advantage. A strain. Nineteen. <laughs> Nineteen hits. Nineteen hits. Okay. 29. 29 also hits. Oh my fucking god. Go for it. Okay, 27. That's all three hits. Beautiful. Okay. That is 3d6 plus 5. <laughs> Goodbye, Barry. <laughs> what, what, what spell? What spell are you about to cast? Um, oh, oh, him. Okay. <laughs> uh, I was, I was going to move off of it anyway, so I'm not going to cry. Fantastic. Fun. Spirit Guardian. I get to reroll. Uh, I was thinking about putting either a Wall of Fire or Whirlwind. True. Wall of Fire is pretty good. 
Especially, yeah, when, I mean. you, especially when you push them through. Yeah. God damn it. Okay, so that would. So that first one is three plus four plus. Oh wait. So it'd be. Eight. That'd be thirteen on the first one. And then, let's see here. Second one. Here, yeah, another reroll. Yay, okay. Uh, that would be... Fourteen? Yeah. Uh, yep, so twenty-seven. Great, two more rerolls. I don't like doing this anymore. Please stop. <laughs> Eight, 10, 15. So all the other. It's 42. Yay. 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 All right, there you go. No, you. <laughs> That's it. All right, yo, dear. All right. Come First of all, dear. there's an automatic 1d4 damage, but now it's magical. Oh my fucking god! One. <laughs> oh boy! Incredible. <laughs> no exhaling gameplay going on right now. Then I regain six health and however much the healing spirit gives me because of like in regeneration. All right. How much does healing spirit give me, Pi? Uh, healing spirit 2d6 plus my wiz mod. I'd rather you roll it. Uh, nine. Incredible. <laughs> so it was just to use up my bonus action. I'll be real with you. So some of the wounds on uh, Yeldir close up. Oh, I just got back. <laughs> Okay. Now the question is, do I want to CC another creature, or do I want to tear this guy to shreds? Flip and tear until it is done. Rip All right. Tear. So, uh, I have his back against my chest, right? Okay. I was asking that as a question. Yes. <laughs> but I'll take that as a yes. Yelder is going to try and, like, move his left arm up to its jaw and try and work it open while with his right hand he holds it out. And then claws much larger than the ones that he uh, unsheathed earlier come out, and he tries and dig them into the creature's mouth and, like, pull out the inside. Okay. That is all. It is all rock, though. You said it's a statue, though. Mm, true. Most statues have like a cave in their mouth, though they don't, they aren't hollow. Oh, yeah, just, just, just grab it by the jaw over. and just. Uh, brutality. Yes. Oh, wait, but I get to add a d4. Bruh. Bonk. Bonk. All right, it hits. That is. On the 8 plus 7. 11 damage. Yay. Yay! And then I'll just try and rake across its chest with the same hand. I'm disappointed. There's no rip and tear until it's done, Gav. Twenty-one. Twenty-one damage. Okay. To hit, not damage. <laughs> oh. Bro, I, I do not do any damage. I am the CC machine. Wait, doesn't your lichen thing do? Oh, okay. Yep, I have plus two to attack and plus two damage. That's it. <laughs> At least it's magical, isn't it? It is magical, yes. This is all magical damage. Sorry. So, 14 damage to him. So, in total. 25. 25. Nice and nice. And then I'm going to move him over the fire. This one. Ah, not the flames. 
through the fire and the flames. Can you move him there? Yes, I can. Pie. Hello. What does the fire do? Ah. Uh, let me grab that for you. Sorry. Uh, healer 2d10 plus my whiz mod. Roll 2d10. Alright, I'm holding an enemy on it. 21. 21. 21. Alright. Uh, you said it's hard to see, but it's still see through, right? Yes. Alright. On. Yeah, on that dude, I want to use Blood Curse of Binding. Alright. Make a strength saving throw, DC of 18. Oh, it fails. He slowly just fades out of existence. For some fucking reason, it's not restrained, but it's grappled. <laughs> oh my God. I don't get it either. I like the hand. Wait, Vulcus of Binding doesn't restrain? Yeah. No, so pretty much just... what would happen is his blood will come out of him, right? And it will form this hand and grab it. Uh, it's actually kind of weird. I'm using the lesser version. I didn't amplify it, so it doesn't do damage to me for casting. Yeah. Okay. It doesn't damage you. It's, it's just what it would do, I guess, flavor-wise. Yeah. <laughs> blood hand. And with the blood. <laughs> My blood just sinks across the ground like an inchworm. <laughs> yeah, it's probably the blood that was beaten out of you from the uh, the golems. It just goes up and it's like, I want revenge, and it just grabs this creature. It's like, and ah! that is. All right. I am going to move the goblin in my hands, or whatever the fuck this thing is, not goblin. I'm Goal. gonna move it back over here so it can't hit on ya. Probably for the best. Back here? Yep. Got it. And that's the end of my turn. Alright, this chunky lad's gonna go over here. We'll give, uh, give Jax the old one too. It has disadvantage on attacks. How? It's restrained. Restrained. How? Oh. Restrained literally does that, dude. I thought restrained doesn't even give him attack. No, it does. You're thinking of stunned. Oh. Uh, you're thinking well, of, um. You're, you're thinking of what I did. <laughs> I do not believe a 16 or 12 hits. No. Well, that's a tragic turn of events. All right. He now, I don't have like... a lot of damage output, but I still feel useful. <laughs> to be honest, to be honest, <laughs> have... to be honest, to be honest, you are a controller. Yeah, jeez. Really <laughs> yeah, you restrained three of them. Yeah, like that's a big controller move right there. That's something I grappled you... two and restrained one. You don't see that in D&D 5e, I don't think. Which controllers anyway. That's very rare. I did try to optimize the Eldir's build for it. <laughs> oh, you're gonna. My, uh, oh, gonna I even be... have Dragon Fear, so I can frighten as well. Oh, it's gonna be amazing when we get to Camilla Carlisle and you do that for like ten, for like, well, no, eight people. <laughs> when can I grapple somebody by holding them in my mouth? <laughs> Bruh. So Ethan just does uh, a couple of uh, upper slashes since this thing is flying in the air mm -hmm. and uh, brings it down. With uh, brings it down to quite a significant amount. Nice. Uh, you see black plumes of uh, fire go off. Nathaniel. All right. Well, I can't be outmatched, so time to swing at this thing. That's a twenty-four to hit. Twenty-four to hit. Does that hit? Yes. Uh, that's a tw That's a thirty-one to hit. 31 to hit? Yes. And that's a 28 to hit. 28 hits. Alright, I'm gonna roll I'm gonna roll a bunch of I'm just gonna roll a bunch of the different damage types at once. So that is that is If you wanna do the easy work for me, it's resistant to your lightning damage. It is? Mm-hmm. Okay, in that case, three, twelve. Twelve plus 17, 17 divided by 17 divided by 2, that's 8. So that's 8 lightning damage, already halved. Okay. And 12. 
12, uh, 16, 16 plus, 16 plus 27, that's 16 plus 27. Forty-three magical slashing damage. Forty-three? Mm-hmm. Is it dead? No. Action surge. Oh. Bruh. Twenty-two. Twenty-two to hit. Yes. Twenty-six to hit. Yes. Twenty-eight to hit. <laughs> I rolled in succession. Ten. Ten. 12, 12 and 16. <laughs> All right, so rolling damage again. 5, 6, 13. That's, that's 40 points of magical slashing. Okay. And what's magical slashing? 16, yeah. 22, 25. 26, 27, 27 divided by two, 27 divided by 2, that's 13 lightning. How do you want to do this? Uh, wait! Well, okay, never mind. Um, I'm going to, so you just, okay. He slashes once, and then he's going mm -hmm. to sheath the sword, and then a bunch of lightning cuts are going to cut through this thing and cut it into ribbons. What a fucking anime nerd. Also, wait. Is it resistant to magical lightning? Oh, no, wait. It's just lightning, because that applies yeah. to both magical and non-magical. Yeah, all right. There we go. And then I'm going to and then I'm gonna walk over to... I'm going to walk over here. 5, no, five 10, 15, 20. I'm going to give... I'm going to give... I'm going to use the help action on... On you. Do you want it this time, or...? Uh... No, it's okay. Give it to someone else. All right, that poor guy is still restrained. Who am I within 30 feet of? Uh, I'm going to give the help action to... Graza for sure. <laughs> hey, go, Graza. Kick yeah. some ass. I'm going to give him the help action on his next attack roll. Also, this is why Yeldir said he was used to being taller than everyone. Hmm. <laughs> Large ah, boy. I see. Large boy. Oh, well, I just realized. I brought up that uh, statues usually have holes in their mouths, but that's if the mouth is open. <laughs> mm. I didn't know if this one had an open mouth or not. Mm, no, but I mean, we'll, we'll say it does for flavor. Uh, for the flavor. That's the rest of my turn, by the way. You created a mouth. That's the rest of your turn. Yeah, oh. when I moved and used the help action on Gaza Gaza tour. On ya! Yeah. You're Smash. Dead. Oh wait a second. I'm sorry. Can I use Blood Curse of uh, the Fallen Puppet on this dude? He fucking did. Oh. All right. Uh, Yelder's gonna have to scratch himself, <laughs> literally, because I'm gonna amplify it. Luckily, you have one arm free now. Oh, come on. <laughs> That's just mean. Seven damage to so it's okay. All right. Uh, what's his move speed? What's his move speed? Yeah. That creature's? Yep. 30. Oh, thank God. All right, it can move up to the grappled one. Mm-hmm. Can you tell me what it's to hit is? Because I also increase it by my int mod. The, the golems? Yeah. Plushkin. No, the whatever died. <laughs> oh, whatever died? Is that a cockatrice? Yeah, something? whatever Nathan killed. Oh, that's plus six. Okay. So its corpse just shambles over to the grappled one. Misses. What fun. <laughs> Bring the corpse over to me. Oh, you want the corpse? Here. You know what? Let me give you control over it. 
Well, no, that's just one thing. Wait, I, I wasn't the one that asked for it. <laughs> oh. Oh wait, no. I thought it was you, I thought it was you who was using it. Zelda. Yeah, I was. With your <laughs> phone. You, yeah. Well, I was saying the cur the, the the corpse should be next to me then, shouldn't yeah, it? Yeah, okay. it's next to Pi. And uh, as always, guys, you know how it is. We're gonna add some fire. Uh, that's not. <laughs> oh wait a second. Since I'm technically attacking, do I get the one d four still? Do you get the one d four? Yeah, the for bless. Damn it, <laughs> fourteen to hit. Fourteen to hit. Yeah. It's. Oh wait. Wait, really? No. Damn. Okay, I didn't think so. <laughs> Lied to you. I was like, no. <laughs> Sad. That's the end of that intermission. <laughs> Going back right. to Anya. I have successfully done seven damage to myself. <laughs> right Anya. Um. Okay. Uh, what's up with this golem right here? He, he's grappled or something. Yeah, he's being held by the big hand of Yeldir. Yeldir's big hand. Mm. Okay. Uh, should I kill this dude? Go all the way over here. There's though. a creature to your northeast. He's weak. <laughs> I see him. His arms. I guess heavy. I should go kill him. All right. Fine. You can hit that once and then just walk over there. If you the go walk to him, I think I can burning hand him. Um. It's up to you though. Mm, I'll get the little guy first since he's right there. Uh, uh okay. Is it? I got one d4. Is that to like when I roll to hit or roll damage? Roll damage. Okay. Uh, from the bless. Yeah. That's to hit. So. Okay. To hit. All right. I'm gonna do my buster sword again. All right. You hit him with that sword okay. with the butter sword. My butter sword. Sword on the butter. Um, I'm a reckless attack. Mm -hmm. And yeah, okay. You can add a D four. I did. Got a fucking one though. <laughs> Oh, With rolls like these, you never stood a chance. <laughs> <laughs> so, 17 and 21. 21? That's the, the damage? No, the hit. They both hit. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Alright. Do we want to add? Uh, no, never mind. Okay. Fuck it. Okay, well, 12, and if I get another 20. Kill me. Okay, <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> um, my DM 24? says, okay, if you say so. She said, she said, no, I didn't mean it. Oh, no. <laughs> Be careful what you wish for. 24 damage. How do you want to do this, girl? Um, I just, I just kill it. Just stab it. She's like a fucking, you know, Guardians of the Galaxy 2 when someone was inside the stomach. <laughs> yes. 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 And she's like that, but with two bastard swords. <laughs> <laughs> Holy at <I'm> one. <laughs> uh, well, since I killed it, I'm gonna. I have great the great weapon master feat, which I need to use. So I'm gonna. I didn't really move. Can I? Then I make it. Okay, yeah, I can. 
I'm gonna go over to this bad boy. Bad boy. And I'm gonna hit it again with my bastard sword. Um. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. God, for the fourteen hit. Fourteen? No. Fuck. Okay. No. No. All right. Well, I'm done. Oh, Graza, mm. can I just get another harm, please? What, what's left? Gaza, you have advantage uh, on your next attack roll. Creatures. Yeah, um... I think the last stuff has changed. So... Ah, uh, you know what? I'll do a fire storm. What? Uh, how does that work? Firestorm? Yeah. It's that's the that's 10x10 ten ten cube, uh, cube spell that I used. Oh god, here we go again. Oh... <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, you can't hit you can't hit this one without actually hitting like the rest of us though yeah so i'll i'll ignore this one and go for this one that and can i do that is that sure. how it works one one two this is one cube uh if i uh, can do, oh, draw the cubes I this is the cube spread out for that yeah another cube you could do the two of them you can do the two of them. Wait, do the 10 by 10 cues have to be connected? Yeah, by at least one side. That's why I'm drawing them like this. Okay. You're drawing 5 by 5 cubes, though. Oh, wait, you're right. 5 by 5 cubes. Wait, strictly speaking, couldn't he? I feel like he'd be able to hit all of them. Yeah, but you'd also have to hit Yeldir for that to really work, or Anya. I'll instead do Spirit Garden. Okay. Oh god, here we go. What does that do? Fifth level. Give me a second, I got it. Uh, spirit. Guardian. There you are. It's an aura. Give me a second, and... Flaming hammers appear. It does that. That? I posted in the last Shred Wolf what it does. Oh no. <laughs> one of the oh, great see. one of the greatest fuck yous a cleric can ever do. <laughs> oh, when infected creature's no speed is halved in the area, and when the creature enters the area for the first time, or starts wait, to turn wait, there. Wait, wait, wait. Fuck, no, it's concentration, never mind. Oh, yeah. shit. Uh, there's so much concentration. Just harm. <laughs> yeah, concentration, baby, join the club. Wait, okay. wait, 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 wait. Oh, shit. Instead, I will... Is animate... Oh, damn it, that's also concentration. Concentration. Uh, and everyone heals some stuff. Mass cure wounds? Yeah, just a uh, fourth level. Why not harm? Hey, actually, <laughs> I was thinking about using mass cure wounds. Uh, so everyone heal 2d4 plus 5. Okay, five, don't. Four. Fuck. Everyone heal 7 points. Yeah, <laughs> Oh, wait, I actually, I actually set my health to seven. <laughs> it's a little bit. It's a little pick me up. <laughs> Everyone heal two health. Oh no! Uh, nope. it's, it's, it's seven. Woo! It's plus five. It's it's two D four plus five. All right. So everybody heals seven health. Yeah. Hey, you Wait. you counteracted the damage I did to myself. <laughs> Wait, I thought Mass Cure Wounds was a fifth level spell that healed 3d8. I think you might be doing Mass Healing Word. Oh, that's it. Sorry, I was looking at the wrong one. Oh. Yeah. Sorry, Mass Cure Wound. Uh, yeah, that's the right one. Sorry. 
Ah, uh, he's doing. Uh, okay. Sorry, I didn't know mass healing word was a thing. I don't do healing spells very often. It is a bonus action, though. I meant to do cat mass cure wounds, not mass cure healing words. So, oh. <laughs> so 3d8 plus 5. That's my bad. So we might want to re-roll that. Yeah. Everyone heal 19 points of damage, not 7. Woo! I was, I was like, huh, that's kind of low for mass cure wounds. Oh, wait. Time to take off my shirt. Woo! <laughs> Oops. Oop. He said oops because he accidentally did actually take off his shirt. Yeah, bro. Uh, I... <laughs> you should know I don't normally have one on. <laughs> Bruh. Hey, man. It's comfy. I will wear whatever I don't want to wear in my own home. <laughs> I ain't the comfy boy. I'm the one who shirts. What's a shirt when you can cry? Oh. Do I, will acknowledge... <laughs> it... I will acknowledge that it's a problem whenever there's a bug somewhere and I don't have shoes on. Mm. Imagine wearing shoes in the house. Imagine shoes. Nope. It's that air Asian stereotype where they don't wear shoes in the house. We do not. Oh. Chippy's curled up in a ball behind me. Wait, oh, is it my turn? Wait, is that an Asian stereotype? Oh, it is my turn. Yeah, Asians don't wear our shoes in the house. Oh, that's... Huh, I guess that's one thing we carried over then. Huh, weird. That my, me, and my, nice. that, me, that me and my mom's family did. I don't wear shoes ever. We know that you wear <laughs> flip-flops when it's snowing outside. <laughs> what the fuck, Car? I'm not kidding. <laughs> okay. Save that for after the session, go. <laughs> I'd like to uh, cast Scorching Ray at a fifth level. Oh, here we go. This. Okay. <laughs> uh, how many is that? That's six rays. Yeah. Look at this grappled buffoon. Oh, wait, should I just? Oh my. Uh, Scorching Ray? Scorching Ray, yeah. Uh, first three to the guy, this guy, right by Nathan. And the last three to the other guy. Yeah, I totally understand this. Wait, don't you have advantage on that since, don't you have advantage on that since you're flanking him technically? Car? What? Do yes. I get flanking? Yes, <sighs> Ethan is flanking. I'm both actually. Well, no, because Nathan's not. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Okay, then it's Ma'am, 25 and now well, I mean, 20. Does his spirit count as flanking? Ma'am, it should. It's still a creature, an ally. Yeah. yeah then then uh, you get advantage on both. For for this one, uh, it's a 25, a nat 20, and a 24. Okay. Yeah, those all hit. And the other one is a 22, 16, 24. Those all hit too. Uh, how much is that? Six to And then I'll add my one date to that. It's a little weird, but it's a Uh. Oh, wait. Did I do this one? No, I didn't. It's wrong. Okay, so for the second one, it'd be three plus six is nine. Eighteen. Uh. That's 30 damage and 18 damage. 30 damage to the one by Nathan, 18 to the other one. Uh, keep in mind, one of those attacks was a net 20, right? Yeah, 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 I. it was the second pair, so it was the 6 and the 3. Okay. Which I doubled. Okay, so 30? Yep. I, uh... And what was the other one? 18. Alright. Is there anything else you could do? Uh, I'm gonna have my flame spear attack this one. The, the 21 hits, I assume, and yes. Uh, does seven damage. That's the end of my turn. Seven, only seven. 
Yeah, my wildfire spear damage does not scale. It's one d six plus proficiency bonus, and it never scales. Yeah. Nope. That that seems weird. Mm. I mean, I'm happy if you can prove me wrong. This but it boy doesn't... is going to no, do I... some punching on a yell deer. No, it, no, that does make sense, but yeah. But like, it's like, wow, we just really let you really didn't scale that. I know. Like at this point, I'm just summoning it just so I can have like the one d eight. Thirty, twenty, action. and eighteen. Eighteen does not hit. Okay. My dude, you get you ready for this shit? You ready for this huge amount of damage? Six. Ten. Ten. Oh boy. Close. What an amazing nose exhaling here that was. <laughs> Fox Neil's going to shoot a guy. He's going to shoot this guy with half of his spears. Pew! I was worried I was going to go into bloodlust because then if this thing died, I would go and attack Fox Neil. No, not Fox Neil. No. Downs that. And he's going to shoot the other one. Please roll high, Fox Neil. I will be so mad if you don't. In the first age, <laughs> there was a golem. No. It was restrained. <laughs> it's still restrained. Never again shall it Perfect not be. Perfect amount. <laughs> I, th I think down that one as well. Three of the golems never got unrestrained. Bruh. One never got ungraffled until it died. This one is still grappled, and that one has been restrained in since the start of combat. And he combat. killed them before they could summon the Baylor. Good lord. Whoo, Jax. You like Jax? You like <laughs> okay. Jax. Now so. you have the same name as my dog. <laughs> my dog. We're gonna right. hit this thing. You're hitting that thing. Okay. Let's see here. Dice. One, 19. Two, 24, three, 19. You All have advantage. Hit. Oh, I have advantage? Yeah, yeah it's restrained. Okay. Damn. Oh <laughs> no, not 20. Mm, Unless you crit 20. on teens. No, I do not. You Damn. Okay. So, damage. D10. It's 3d10 plus. Yeah, it'd be 3d10 plus. 18. Oh my. Oh my god! And then my 1d6 is... <laughs> a 9, an 8, and a 9. What the... oh. and, uh, and then I get to reroll that 1 and that 2. Watch so, some both b6s. Uh, uh. So, yeah. Alright, so that's a 12 and a 44, so 56. Yep. And that's all magical too, right? Damn. Yes. Oh, fucking... That's one hell of a bonk. <laughs> <laughs> Be it. Alrighty. There you go. That was, that was one hell of a bonk. Anything else? No, uh, that's it. Alright. Yell deer. Alright. Yeah, dude is gonna put his claws against his own chest and like scrape across it. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to make this additional 1d8 damage useless. Uh, now watch as I lag. Oh, hey, only one damage. <laughs> wow. I seem to be losing connection. Okay, that's not good. 
Alright, so as he drags his claws across his belly, the claws, like, seem to gather up frost and get colder until they're encased in ice. Nice. Then I am going to try and cut through his fucking skull from the top half. Well, okay. his skull that doesn't exist because he's mode of stone. Uh, 17 to hit. Yep, that hits. That is... Oh, I should have just rolled 2d8 plus 5. That's 20 damage. All magical. Oh, wait, I forgot to do the automatic 1d4 damage. So, 20, 23 damage. Okay. And then after he drags his claw down, he's gonna bring it right back up. Oh, shit. 22 to hit. Yep. Aw, 11 damage. How do you want to do this? I want to knock his head straight up into the tree. <laughs> it, it flies into the tree. The tree's leaves make a nice little rustling sound as it comes back. It just <laughs> dust kind of glitters in its place. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> You breathed in Ooh. some of the dust. I breathed in some of the dust, damn. Oh, Pi, how much healing do I get from the spirit? Oh, yeah. 16 health. Okay. You know what? I think I've done enough harm to Jax. I'm going to go and try to hit um, on That's you. not the end of my turn. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> All right. I have 45 movement, and I'm big. <laughs> Please don't, sir. Yell to your grabs, Gary, no. by the throat and grab them with no. him. I get one more attack. Stop. <laughs> Plus 12. Uh, 31 to hit. <laughs> 12 damage. Bruh. Oh god, you rolled poorly too. Yeah. Now that's the end of my turn. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> don't jump off a cliff. Do not. You don't get to die. You don't get to die just yet. You don't get to die until the campaign's over. It's okay, it's speed when, is zero. When the when your campaign is ashes, then All you right. have much to die. <laughs> the fire. Wait, no, he's gonna... It didn't do anything? It probably doesn't do anything. He hasn't taken any damage. Uh, who has let me let me check my druid stuff. Wait, He's I did damage do... to it. Yes, you did. Oh, I can I, I can use my reaction okay. to do it. But I did Wait, didn't you already use your reaction? Me? Yeah, I thought you already did. Oh no, that was uh, that, that wait, no, that was turns ago. Never mind. No. You know, uh <sighs> Yeah, no, you're not, uh, the flames don't go off as soon as you walk through them. I have to use my reaction when you walk through them. So you good. Um, Ethan, with the combined efforts of uh, Anya, Jax, and a little punch from Yeldir, managed to dissipate the last uh, golem. Yay! Nice. Oh, onto a bunch of fine powder and ass. Ass? Ass. <laughs> oh god, it's getting late. Whew. Um, pile of ass. <laughs> All right, this combat is over. Hopefully, yeah. we don't need the demon of hatred anymore. <laughs> um, demon of hatred. This me nailed it. It is. Um, I can't wait to bring this back. For I am though. <laughs> He's gonna hate me. Nailed Lord. it. You're right. I am gonna hate you. No, I think I Cookie do is. Hate you. Oh. Oh, oh! <laughs> what? Bruh, cookie moment. What? Well, that's that. Now I'm the What top. do you all wish to do? Is there any loot? Well, there's a couple of gems from the, uh, the golems. Some sapphires and rubies, both of which equal up to 250 GP. Each or all together? All together. Mm. 
I'd you know, say each. Nah, each. Uh, I take a couple of those. I take like three of those and to- I take like, no, I take, how many of them are there total? Uh, two sapphires, two rubies. I'll take one of the sapphires and to- and like flick it over to, and like with my thumb flick it over to Ethan. Alright. Yo, dear wishes for the small. Yo, can someone snip Back that loving couple cards. over there? <laughs> Look at them. I They're long lost lovers. They're uh the, the 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 fire the fire spirit is Mary and the other one's Barry. What animals oh are they? <laughs> <laughs> From the uh weird raptor looking demon things, uh out of their steaming bodies are diamonds you can find. The entire total worth of all the diamonds is three hundred GP. Hmm. Huh. So that's four four of them, that's so that's I... Andrew. Yeah, I'll take hmm? that in case I think I have to cast resurrection. Okay. I think my rib cage is broken. Oh here. Sure. Uh, fine. Well, that was fun. Right? I killed two things a day. Proud of myself. Barry's gonna get you some healing. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Barry. Well, you're uh, this close to the spirit of destruction. <laughs> One ev- plus my spell ev- cast, man. Everyone heal 31 points of uh, damage. Okay. Damn. 31? Yeah. And is anyone still damaged? Oh, I have to. Oh. I was never damaged. Oh, this entire fight, Jesus. Wait, are you healing me for 12 and 13 or just 12? Question. Uh, you're the only one damaged, right? No, I think there are other people damaged. I, I, I just sealed everyone. Uh... Yeah, anyone else who's oh, damaged. Yeah, okay, so 14, 13, 12, 13. Jesus. Uh, uh, total of 52. 27, 39. <laughs> and with that, the loving couple disappears from sight. No! <laughs> they have their own personal time in their realms. <laughs> My room. Now I have a splinter. <laughs> the oh two damage. I <laughs> barely did anything, bruh. Well, okay, guys. Uh, and, this just, and this just was level 15. Imagine what level 17 is going to be like. Okay, guys. So I cast an 8th level heal on the LT. Oh my god. <laughs> Not actually. I, I cast an 8th uh, high level heal. Well. well well, I'm gonna gather up all the iron bands and turn them back into a sphere. Also, um, I kind of take, I kind of ask for my, I kind of grab the pieces of uh, of what used to be, no, the two halves of what used to be a Jax's sword, and hand them to him while I, <laughs> while asking for the long sword back. <laughs> anyone, here know, anyone here know mending I'll... by chance? Oh. I am. Uh, I have mending. I also have him. Let uh, let the Forge cleric do his job. Let the Forge cleric <laughs> do his job. <laughs> I trust you far more than I do. Car. Myself with the S sword. I'm still big. No. No, he said. You are not huge. No, Car. No, Car. Did, did, <laughs> oh, Car, 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 did you see in chat? He said, "Turn him small. He's small sized." Oh thank God. <laughs> He's like, uh, what's his face? The, the thick wolf from the other game. Bismuth. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I Permanently the, lowered. I, I fixed the sword. Nice. So now oh, the... yeah, with mending. Yep. Yeah. Jax, you get your sword back. I get mine back. Glares at each of you. What? <laughs> he gives it back. What? <laughs> <laughs> and don't break the merchandise. I got a pretty little heart with all the characters. Oh, oh yes, I'd like you to have my sword back, please. Why are you glaring at us, man? We didn't break our weapons. Well, the demon book is. <laughs> Put three of the dead enemies in this heart. Oh, gosh. Beautiful. Oh, Smelt down the rock into a. Have a wonderful rest for the evening. So let me just. Let me take these. And just oh, we're shaped in the we're in the shape of a heart. Yeah, Kara said that. 
<laughs> I'm not very smart. <laughs> and you guys camp, and this is now the exact looking map. It's one for one. You find a nice owl clove by a river with a little bridge going over it. Uh, we on the I, this is a very nice place to set up. We're not on the map. We're dude, not we, on didn't, map. we didn't change maps. You, you didn't move us to the other map yet, dude. Fuck me. <laughs> Pass. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> All right. Oh, we're on the we're on the we're on the car watermarked map. <laughs> Oh my god, that's that's a crudely drawn car. Hmm. Well, let's get some peaceful music, I guess, in here. Alright, give me a second. I'm gonna dunk my head in the river. <laughs> well, I gotta say that was a bit thrilling. Hmm. Yeah. You got haven't gotten to do something like that in a while. Yeah. You guys, you were, um, you were pretty good out there. Hmm. It's quite, quite the impressive bunch. Was happy to was happy to face a demon. Happy to face something something <laughs> big and powerful again. Oh, I guess big and powerful, quote unquote. <laughs> I don't think we even barely took a scratch in that. Powerful <laughs> enough to be grabbed by, for two of them to be grabbed by a single dragonborn. It is night, too. So let me just. Yeah. Get... Yeah, that, uh, unfortunately, with Vivify specifies it needs a diamond to be used. Yeah, yes. same same with Resurrection. Yes, it's yeah. just that it's, and you need a diamond for this. So, I need that diamond to cast them. <laughs> just in case. Wait, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. Because on the Cassia setting, material system's out. Really? Yeah. We threw it okay, out. I... Yeah, yeah. Fuck. I, I, I added those G I added those diamonds for no fucking reason. I fucked myself over with my own system. No! <laughs> yeah, I was like, wait a minute, no! Cassie. I was like, wait a minute, Cassie wait, so, has no material. So what he do? It has no material? Yeah, Cassia does not require materials. You only need you only need verbal and somatic in Cassia to cast a spell. You don't need material components. Yeah, I mean, I, 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 couldn't you just cast true resurrection without the twenty five thousand? Yes. That's what the great. Fuck? <laughs> Nasty. Yeah, I, 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 it was my first D and D world, so I was just like, "Well, I don't feel like I don't feel like keeping track of all these materials." So, no materials, folks. <laughs> right. Oh my dear lord, dear lord, the dear lord, the dear uh, lord. Uh, can we? Let's mm. see, spirit. Anyway, I kind of I kind of look at uh, Ethan and I kind of say, "Yeah, you were pretty good out there." I, for a split second, I was almost expecting you to pull off a blink step. <laughs> uh, I still need some practice on that one. Oh yeah, trust me, it takes a lot of practice. I felt moving, have, making sure that you can get the right speed and not fall flat on your face. Tough. Very tough. Or just going right into a wall. <laughs> yeah. See the yeah, that actually that happened to me once. We fought like this massive roper thing inside an enclosed space and I was literally bouncing off walls doing that. Oh, well. That's that is definitely interesting to be sure. Yeah, it was not fun. Uh, it was covered in like a, it was covered in a chunk of metal and basically had metal armor. It killed one of my friends. Well one of the guys that was there. But then he came back, so I need to get flowing water in here. And funnily enough, that wasn't even oh. the that wasn't even the craziest thing we fought. And what was that? What would that be? Uh, depends. Anya, would you say that the dragon or the phoenix was crazier? Uh, he mm. seems a bit spooked by that. Definitely the phoenix. Uh, phoenix. Uh, dragon. Hmm. Both fire based, yeah. funnily enough. Huh. That is something. <laughs> you all right there? I just I'm very shocked. You seem to have handled quite a many creature uh many dangerous creatures. I feel like this would have been very dangerous for me had I done it alone. <laughs> well, that's because I was able to lean on other people to help. 
It's not like I would have been. Yes. I wouldn't have been. It's not like me and Anya would have been able to face a dragon or a phoenix by ourselves. Though I'm glad. I'm sure she would have liked to try. And for that, I'd like to thank all of you. He kind of gets just to that for your hard work. Anyways, I think we should get some sleep. Looks uh, like we might need it. Huh. I can summon a temple with an hour ritual. What? What spell? Uh, temple of the gods. Temple of the gods. Oh yeah, Xanathar. Um. Yeah, I. I, <laughs> I can do this. Oh my god. Yeah. I. I, I, I summon a fucking fortress. Oh my god. Right, is it? Uh. And it doesn't I even require for this. Okay, I, I want to say this: it doesn't even in a in a, in a system that requires uh, components. All it requires is a holy symbol with five gold. Bruh. Did someone leave? Was it Zenvu? Uh, no, it was uh, No, it was Aleph. The other Z guy. I <laughs> uh, just trash for me. Oh, oof. Bruh. Bruh. No, I guess I, I kind of want to ask what we got. What's the craziest things you guys have fought? Uh, some guy that used cards for magic. It was really fucking annoying. Cardcaster. <sighs> oh, uh, yelled here. <laughs> hmm. Oh, he didn't hear what you said. Can no, you I heard what he said. I said that. no. I was making a joke saying cardcaster. That's. Well, I mean, you got what he thought. <laughs> Hmm? <sighs> yeah, it's a really good place to hold up. It, don't, yeah. it doesn't provide food like the wizard one, but... Wait, isn't there one that sends you to a... No, no, that's a magic item, never mind. The wizard one just creates a... a demiplane, basically, of a, of a mansion. Mag Morning kind of magnificent mansion? Yes. Yeah. Bro, I love that spell. Guess what? Hmm? No, I, I'm playing a wizard next in my in the actual game. So think about that. Do I need to just get a uh, to go mansion map for you? No, no. Uh, well, not maybe, yet. I mean, it can be as big as I want. So. Yeah. Wait, no, I can't. It's a uh, you can map it however you want, but. It's a certain size. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry. I can, I can make it however basically I want. And considering I, got, I, I I'm going to say this. I don't ever fight anything in it because I control who goes in and out. Yeah, the door is also invisible when you're inside, isn't it? Yeah, I can. <coughs> you can choose. I love Mordenkainen's Magnificent Mansion. Mm -hmm. All right. Because I feel right. like I feel like it's the perfect example for a safe space. It's basically an upgrade. It's basically an upgrade from uh, what is Lemons. it? It's tiny hut. Yeah, Lemon's tiny hut. My, like morning, kind of looked at Lemon's tiny hut and was like, "Oh, you sweet summer child. Let me show you how it's done." <laughs> <laughs> this is how you make a. This is how you make a home. I, I think. Tiny hut. I think my favorite high level spell though is Force Cage. Yeah, yeah. Just sit in a box while everybody else fights, and then you can use any sight spells. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Considering you can uh, conjure the uh, the hunt, I think the mansion's just a step, the next step. True. Um, so long rest. Uh, watches. Oh yeah, I'll take the I'll take the first one. I'll do the second one. I'll do, the I'll, do, one. I'll do midnight or after that. Alright, can someone roll a d100 for me? I got it. That's uh, a 69. Nice. nice. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. First watch. That's me. 
Uh, the LG is not taking watch, but he's going to be up for the middle watch. 23. Each one's going to be with you in the first watch. All right, 23, pa 23 perception. So basically equal to my passive. Three perception. Okay. Okay. So uh, the two, uh, he he goes over by the water, and just kind of kicks his feet in there. Uh, yeah. Just to note, it's two o'clock. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I know. I I'm ending we're... very shortly. I think it's... I've... I've what? Uh... After this day ends, I'm ending. Yeah. Nathan's going to walk over and kind of just stand next to him, kind of like using his um, sword and its sheath as a bit of a cane in a way, as he kind of like plants it on the sand. So, black flame sword. So, uh, lightning sword. <laughs> What's the story? The story? What's the story behind the black flame? <laughs> um. Well, fuck. <sighs> Would you say it was a magic blade that uh I happened to stumble across? My question would be then, did you, my question would be then, did you sell your soul for it? <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Oh yeah, I wish. <laughs> Who had it before you? I don't know. Some skeleton-looking guy. Hmm. It's very ominous. Hmm. Nothing happened after you grabbed it. He'll just uh, kind of look out. Start skipping stones. He's not going to answer your question. <sighs> I kind of kind of sigh for a moment. Is it kind of sigh for a moment? <sighs> Is it a curse? Something like that. I have well, the roll persuasion. All right. Um. Where's my persuasion at? Uh, plus one. Not 20, 21. Oh my fucking god. Uh, yes, it is a curse. <sighs> it takes the life of anyone who holds it. Who holds it? Wields it, yes. And the moment I bound to it, my life is entirely in its hands. Well, there are a couple of clerics here that can use remove, remove curse. I have a ton of money to burn on finding a way to finding a way to get that curse off of you. He sighs and gets up. I appreciate the sentiment, but I think I'm already dead at this point. <laughs> he kind he kind of like grabs him by the shoulder. Oh come on now! The only person the only <laughs> person here that's a dead man walking is me. Maybe we're both dead men walking. Trust me, trust me, trust me, when I say that you have a lot more of a life to lead. <laughs> so, so if, so if that's the case, is this why you wanted my help to go after the, go after her? Uh, he, he tries to answer, but... Then you hear? Mm -hmm. The ground rumbles beneath you as he tries to answer. Waking everyone up. The hell? Yeah. What? Uh, Foxney, uh, well, you know, Nathan and Ethan are over here. Foxney, uh, Grasta, Verder, Jax, Anya, Ariane, Yeld, everyone make a deck save. Aha! Uh -huh, something I'm good at. Next save. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a 21. No! <laughs> oh. Hey, this man rolled a 16 with the nat one. Uh oh. Uh, 1d6. 
I'm gonna use. I got a twenty-one. Uh, what are we doing? Deck Sorry. save. Oh, deck yes. save. I was reading. Twenty-one. Something. Let me know if you're the unlucky soul who rolls lower than a twenty. Seventeen. Twenty. <laughs> can I dive in after Anya? Huh? Hmm? Can I can I dive in after Anya? Sure. We're about to fall? Yes, the ground underneath us. I, I would assume anyway, because the I would think since explosion happened. Well, as this is happening, nothing happens. <laughs> Wait, what? I was going to do divine intervention, but I need a fifteen or below, so nothing happens. No, nothing happens. <laughs> fifteen or below. Yeah. Fifteen and below, and my god, <laughs> it's my level or below. You please fell fell on deaf ears. And I can do it each day until it succeeds, and I have to wait a week. Wait, what are you getting divine intervention from? What? I'm Tenth level cleric. Level. What do you think I'm getting it from? Oh, I've just never heard of it. Yeah, it's a 10th level cleric feature. 10th yep. level cleric. You can... Yep. Imploring your deity section requires you to use your action, destroy the systems you need, and roll percentile dice. So, I'm going to try and die for Anya to catch her. Okay. Don't even get the effects of a long rest, Cry. Oh, cool. Uh, <laughs> you thought it was going to be that easy. <laughs> well, she would have, uh, 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 I guess. Wait, would that have at least counted as a short rest since an hour passed? I don't suppose we're being attacked by hill giants. <laughs> no, no short rest. All right. Hill giants? No, no hill giants. All right, it did not bite us. What hill place. giants have the ground explode? <laughs> <laughs> so is the ones that are inside the ground. So is the ground oh, cave? Oh, so is the ground caving in? What is the ground? No, the ground is exploding. Oh, okay. Um, we're fighting the earth itself. I think yes, I you're fighting the entire earth itself. <laughs> I think I kind of. I think I know what this is about to be. The hell? Let me push the earth. What happens then? Okay, so anyone who has made less than a twenty on that save, take forty-nine uh, bludgeoning damage, non-magical. Baby. And you succeed. If you succeed, you take half that. Wow, you finally did damage to me for once. You said forty-nine. Mm -hmm. Two twenty-four. Okay, that was in character, by the way. King giant. Hey, I well, had... angle twenty-four too. Uh, I see. Uh, no, because you rolled less than a twenty. You rolled less than a twenty. But resistant. Are you raging? Oh no! Sad. Okay. Damn, full forty-nine. Actually, that's not bad. I got a lot of health. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, aren't I glad I escaped? Well, no, you took half. <laughs> oh, I took half? Yeah. How much was it? I'm sorry. 20, we take 24. The people yeah. who got over 20 get, take 24 damage. Yeah, well, I'm saying, like, I'm glad I didn't take the full blow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, so glad I escaped. <laughs> meanwhile, uh, uh, meanwhile, Nathan's diving after and You're like, shit. Uh, oh, yeah. no, I wish I was Bullgate, and this is now. Oh, hey, you I don't even right? get frightening presents. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, all right. He's a fifth. I'm gonna wipe off the dust on it on her. And as the the dust and, uh, settles and clears, um, there are a lot of people who are around you, but the most notable is God. Post in this God himself. <laughs> this weird-looking Lupin wearing a mask of sorts, wielding two. Purple esque blades. You divide uh, There are two blades that uh, attack us. <laughs> seem to change with purple lightning. <laughs> really? Uh, you see what looks like a uh, scroll kind of burn away from his hands <laughs> as he uh, places his hands on his swords. Let's see. Uh, and he, he looks at uh, all of that and is like, target acquired. And that is where I'll end that for today. Wait, wait, you said there's a bunch of people? Target acquired.
I'm gonna chuck yes. a ball at him. Oh uh, God, I was hoping it could. I was hoping it could be. I'm I gonna could... chuck my spell at him. <laughs> God. You know what? No, nah, no. Nah. I was gonna. I was, I was gonna say if they, if there like some type some type of dialogue happened, like where they were threatening us, I would literally just have Nathan just look at Anya and just be like, please. <laughs> Please. Form of the dragon. <laughs> just fucking. Oh, we're gonna kill you now. Oh, are you? <laughs> nope, just target acquired. That's all you get. And Vulgate. I'm making them Vulgate. Sorry. Nope. Two huh. Vulgates. Oh, now that's oh, three two people. Vulgates. Oh, now that's Me, uh, that's two party members I get to kill now. Three yeah, Vulgates. Yeah. They're multiplying at rapid. <laughs> Three Vulgates. Oh, shit. Wait.